this empty town I'm searching for the lost and found But you don't care, you're unaware Keep moving like the scars aren't even there It's in the air, like a blazing flare Pointing, blaming you, you did not know So, already, I know Scotty's come here to pester my fucking character with these. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, um, welcome in, everybody. I'm gonna go ahead and just wait a little longer to get some people in here, but we are gonna head on over there very, very soon after we get some little background music. Actually, you know what? We'll keep background music off until we start patrol. Um, but yes, welcome, welcome, everybody. Today is a special day. Uh, we are introducing a... <laughs> A new character. Um, I'm trying to see what's going on over there. I'm, I don't want to go over there. I really feel like something's going to happen. Um, but yeah, I finally got into an LEO department. No, this does not mean I've left Civ. 
I'm a civilian auxiliary, aka a civ reserve, and I've got some pretty fucking amazing civ stories I actually have uh, set up, not only for this character, but um, for some a couple of future uh, characters as well that I want to introduce. Um, but yeah, this here is uh, my new character. Um, oh my gosh. <laughs> God damn you, Cop Rock. So how many panic buttons are you gonna press in one patrol? Well, Cop Rock, hopefully none. I swear to God, if someone shoots me just for the sake of me being a new deputy, I'm not gonna be happy. Uh, but Cop Rock, thank you very much for the 5,000 bits. I do appreciate that a lot. Um, and thank you for the Prime subscription. Um, this is not Deputy Ca uh, Campbell, guys. This is Deputy Kavanaugh. Um, shit, Deputy I went to fire automatically. Three. I gotta go to Sheriff. And I gotta clock in. I forgot everything is different here now. I gotta clock in on this <laughs> Sheriff's side. <clears throat> 41. I did not leave any departments, guys. Um, but really quickly, before we head on over there, uh... Again, this here is... God damn it. This here Dang is Shazam. Harley Cavanaugh. This is a character based off of a Red M character that I have. Um, I love my Red M character. She's definitely modernized Dang and she's Shazam. very different, but she's going to have kind of same personality and a bit of an interesting backstory that you guys will have to figure out. Um, she is a 32-year-old uh, female, obviously. Um... As you can see, uh, she's here to start the day, uh, and one thing that I've noticed a lot of people not utilizing a lot is walking styles. So this is the walking style I did pick for her. She's gonna be kind of confident, kind of, uh, assertive. She's definitely a more quiet, reserved type of person, and she's pretty serious about things. She can have a laugh, and she is gonna have my voice, but it's gonna be, um, a little more relaxed, more serious. Stuff like that. My badge is not given to me. We are getting that badge today. What the fuck is that kind of car? <laughs> I think that's the Barner's vehicle there. Um, I haven't chosen a hat for her. If she d does plan to- please don't come to me. Oh dear. Good day, ma'am. Good day. Female Les. Uh, I don't think Les uses his walk style. He uses a much slower walk style. Fucking Mr. Barner, you're... Oh my god, there's so many people here. Uh, yep. Oh, yep. I see. We're for starting good, huh? My bad! <laughs> That's what happens when you go work. I assume I'm over here. <laughs> Jeez, uh, death. If, if, if I were you, I'm I would assume I'm over up. here. I've never done this before. <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to do. God. Well, we, we need to squeeze uh, this line a little tighter. Mm -hmm. Yes. What's up, Sheriff? Can everybody scoot a little closer? Nobody's gonna bite here. Except me. Six, seven. Look Let's at how many ahead. of you there are. There's right. so uh, many people here. Pretty close to the wall. Thank you, DJ the Man, for the subscription there. I am gonna go ahead and right, focus yeah, on the briefing, guys. Yeah, so I'll be back with you after. Sit back, scoot over. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Kevin, I'll come see you. Come right here. A little bit, yeah, why? Who here is okay with taking a civilian ride along for patrol? First thing first. Figure this out. There's someone in a civilian. Uh, no, uh, I feel so bad yeah, for the person who has to take him. Yet. Shit, Shit, okay. sir. Yeah, yes. can you scoot over? I have a gentleman from DOT on the phone. He wants to know where uh, he wants to meet up. Oh my god, DOT I don't know where they want me. I think they want to give me my badge. Uh, I don't know about that. I heard nothing about you guys. Yeah, you're gonna have to have him call um, us back. I is Les in here? I don't, I don't I know. I gotta call back though. Where do you want me? Give me just a second. I'm sorry. And then what? No, no, no. Scoot over to where this guy is. Oh Very my nice gosh, time. the oh. deputies. <laughs> McMillan! <laughs> Listen, I, you guys yes, all Les, have feelings. Les right is now. on. I don't know. Oh, there he is right there. Actually, civic. he's hiding behind the pillar. McPaul? What is That's going nice. on here? Over next to Montana. They're both going Definitely on a ride along. Oh my fucking Paul. god. You want us to hold hands as Beautiful. well? Beautiful. Shut up. Probably not. <laughs> I, I don't know how our vision goes. They never told me. How would you like to lovely young lady for a civilian ride along? Before. Or after Steph when he gets back in line. Um. Anyways. I need someone Jesus. to do it, so if no one does it, I'm going to start telling people to do it. Okay, I don't know. I can't. I'm on a motorcycle, so. There's... I don't think there's enough room for all of us. I'm about, we're about to play... We're, we're about to play... Uh, <laughs> what is that? What is that game? Why don't we get on the other wall? Uh, wait, are, like, are you just telling someone to volunteer for it? I have, like, I no someone, fucking... Yes, I need someone to take a civilian no ride along. Oh, boy. <laughs> 
<laughs> Good luck. So you're not gonna volunteer for it? Uh, I mean, okay. I think I think you Apollo right there. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I think you volunteered for it. I don't know what's going on. You're taking you're taking the nice young lady back there. I think actually he's gonna be taking the nice young gentleman over here. I'll be taking the lady. Um. Okay. Go ahead and turn the. Okay. What, what did you say? Radio up just a little bit here. I, said, I did not leave Civ, guys. Gentlemen. I did not leave Civ. No, I'll explain things here. once we're done here. A little bit more if you so choose. You don't have to be so Gosh, close. Wait. I just wanted to get oh, everybody. It is. Don't even. Oh, I don't know where we're Stephanie. going. I'm just gonna sit right here. Just, just leave it. Leave it. We'll we'll explain our character a little more once we actually get going. Separately. No, it's it's time to start. Get in line, Lieutenant. I don't think anyone's going to flirt with this character. This character's not going to allow flirting, and there's a reason why, which I'll, uh, again, go into the, a bit of her her uh, character. We're going to have okay. uh, Montana out as BCI Investigations. We'll have McCall out as Warrant. He will also be taking uh, one of our civilian ride-alongs today. We will also have Gray out as... MC hey, we can't hear over here. Can you guys hear me oh, now? My. Yes. Okay. For subdivisions today... Uh, you all we have Montana out as investigations. We have McCall out as warrant, and we have Gray out as MBU. So Ted, so you can uh, contact them, and they will be more than happy to come out. Uh, no new operations uh, today, so I don't know um, what the... at least not out of the county. So uh, if any of them are scheduled later, we'll be notified about that. What are the cop ones? And no new um, warrants cop, or bullets. Cop, cop two and cop three. Okay. Check the. <laughs> Uh, CAD, if you uh, want to look at those. And then uh, no listening. new announcements or policy breaks as of right now. I'll go ahead and pass it over to Lieutenant. Um, I don't really have anything for you guys. It's been a while since I've been here. So, I I mean, well, other than one thing I do have, in terms of adding on to what Myron said, I don't have anything. Um, Kavanaugh, can I get you over here, please? Sure, would you like to do the honors? You get it. Alright. Okay. Oh, that's a bad one. <laughs> I hate that one. That one's garbage. Everybody join me. Give Kevin a round of applause. Coming our newest deputy here, Blaine County Sheriff's Department. Oh, it's so She's going to be uh, going on her first ride on tonight, so everybody wish her the best of luck. Thank you very much, everybody. Nice to meet you. All right, you can return to your position. Yes. Um, I'm about to get that anyways, badge on in just other a second. I don't have anything. I will pass it off. Hell to yeah! I can't wait to do some I fucking in, in, uh, uh, like I'm be out internal with, department uh, relationship building with it, all, everyone so here. It's gonna be amazing. Guys, any accidents, anything along those lines? <laughs> I'll be out. I'll be there. Um, it's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be 80 degrees out, so it's gonna be a little hot. Make sure you have water. Whatnot. It's cooler um, in the game than it is in, in my yeah, room. Yeah, we have two civilian ride-alongs, so just keep that in mind. And then obviously one patrol ride-along. So, please be careful when you're on scenes if any of them are around. Um, thank you, Hugo, there. for the subscription there. Yes, I appreciate thank you, that. Everybody for showing up. What's today? it like now being a high rank? A quick point. I don't mind please it. Please take care of our civilian ride-along as they are um, old. This is their first experience with us. And old. So, um, also, oh if my you can, get the chance to welcome our newest deputy to the department. As you just saw, she got her badge. So, uh, yeah. It's a nice day outside. Let's drive safe, be safe, and just have a good time. Um, oh, okay. Other than that, I don't really have anything. Off to our <laughs> wonderful I'm honestly really fucking nervous. I'm super nervous. Not much for me. Let's uh, make sure we have our phones turned off during briefing, please. <laughs> other than that... Us and the uh, new gal over there. Oh man, take care of yourself, stay safe. Everybody, <laughs> have a good one. Kevin, are you gonna be with me tonight, by the way? All right, zone. Uh, McCall, all right, we're with Jim, Lieutenant. Sure Lieutenant, you real quick? uh, I think it was yeah. McMillan yeah. taking yeah. this right along. You just walk Hold back on. here. I gotta have a word with the sheriff in the yeah. office really quick, so you can just wait outside. Well, all right, yeah, um, come to me. Which one do you I'm want? sorry, you want, uh, for everybody to clear out. Oh, you want me? Yeah, yeah. So, oh, you want me outside? No, 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 yeah. Uh, you can just wait outside the door here, really quick. I'd have a word with the sheriff. Well, I'll fiddle with my badge here, yeah, make sure it's on right. Tonight, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um, <laughs> we need to set up our badge. <laughs> so, give me one sec, guys. I actually have to figure out what the badge number is. Uh, policy uniform. I'm gonna be 1041 10 8, active investigation. 
or see if you right. want the nature. And we will be awesome. again um, going over this character just a little more once I, I just I just acquired your bad that last warrant I signed basically that search warrant and property yeah. Uh -huh. yeah um I just got with Lou today you got a proof okay um females bags and parachutes per se you want just head off to metro it is or... 81 yeah since it's strictly out of lspd we don't really have anything all right to do with again it. guys i will go through some things in just a sec and let them know whoever Please wanted it filed up. and oh. let them know that it was approved and, and they're all good to yeah, go I that flesh, you know, that it's been approved. okay there we go she got her How badge warrant number 062 going all right let's um, actually test out nah i mean not okay that's a good one for her if you know what is copy um that person's brain Okay, cop three is that. A lot Beautiful. So cop, okay, cop yeah, two is what we need. I do have the overlay yet. Yep. As you guys can see there on the uh, thing, I think I'm gonna keep yeah, the overlay there happen. because it works really uh, well yeah. right there. Um. Oh well, Jesus Christ! We're getting yeah, a lot of dancing duck today. A little slow. At least with the new ones coming. Up. We're gonna go ahead and just wait. Yes, patiently. guys. I can yeah, see chat. I am here, but don't worry. I'm gonna cause chaos here, especially on Yekka with the dancing duck. Thank you very much. Message was listening to Brave before I posted this. Thank you, Coprock, for the 5,000 bits again. I do very much appreciate yeah, uh, that. You're being very kind today. Um, again, we'll explain the character a little more way. once um, quietness happens. Um, overall, this is a new character, guys. This is Harley Cavanaugh. Right. She is uh, from my Red a, M a break, I community. I, I played her in uh, Red M uh, way before this. She is modernized. Uh, I can't really... Uh, I couldn't have the ponytail that I had for her. Oh, yeah, it's like actually, a pretty ponytail. Her glasses are obviously modernized. Stuff like that. But her personality is going to be relatively the same as what I have. My badge number is obviously 221, guys. I had It was open. Hell yeah, I'm going to fucking take that. Yes, she's a more serious character. Um she can banter a little bit but overall she's yeah, but she's an older was... person she's 32 yeah. for instance um right. she is uh yeah she won't take just i post a warrant in i guess they're setting something up over yep. there you got um, it then awesome. she's looked like she's waiting to get in trouble with less i right. doubt it i feel That's like her and right. less could actually get Alrighty. you have awesome. a good day. um a long well Cheers, because less is more of a serious character as well so she looks 28 um I've tried to make her look a little older, but then she looked way too old. But, you know, at 30, I'm 20, guys, I'm almost 29 years old, and I look like I'm, ho hopefully I look like I'm 20. So, you know, looks can be deceiving. Harley Quinn, God, don't make a joke about that Harley Quinn bullshit. Oh my God. So yeah, we're just waiting right now. We got our badge. Um, But yeah, right now she, I, I'm not sure if I'm going to have her live in a trailer right now, a trail, uh, an RV. Or if I'm gonna have her live in a small house in Polito, I'm still deciding that it's I, I gotta gotta get her backstory a little more uh, shaped up. Uh, she's gonna start from bottom and and move up. <laughs> um, w yes, she will be playing off duty, guys. She definitely will. She has her own story. I'm gonna have a story with this character. This character is more prone to be her mud. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna permer her. Hello there. Howdy. Just ignores me. Um, yeah, she is going to be more prone to being killed off. Uh, I'm not going to promote her, like, immediately after, like, a month or two. No, but, uh, she's not, like, a three-year long-term character. I'll tell you that now. She's not a, she's not a Campbell. Um, I am going to let generally roleplay happen to her and see, you know, where it goes from that. Uh, I think I'm just waiting for Valentino. Uh... Danger zone. All right. Apparently, I put I put in my hex code earlier, but I guess it's not working. So they're not gonna find me today. I can't exactly fix it right now. Um. Thank you very much for the danger zone. Am I also going K9? Uh, yes. Koi, K9 Koi is totally coming back, guys. As long as I can get into the K9 division. Um, she's definitely going to be coming back. I want to go into Game Warden, K9, and Investigations with this character. Nothing else, really. Um, I know SRU would be fun, but I kind of want to keep to her char character's personality. She probably would um, maybe do like a SWAT slash SRU, whatever the hell they call it, in Sheriff's Department, but yeah. Yeah, me being in this apartment is not temporary, no. Okay. 
How's your day going uh, this far? Miss, sorry? How's your how's your day going this far? Oh, this far. I thought you said Miss Far. Should I be going into your... Uh... Yeah, yeah. It's going very well, actually. The, the weather's very, very nice. Hey, Lieutenant. You know, yes. Yeah, what's going on? What, what, what did you have to talk to the sheriff about? Detective Kavanaugh. Uh, yeah. Oh, we were just talking about some investigation stuff. I can see you're being uh, a detective. Case we had. Okay, because I, um, I was going to say, I remember, you know, I, I kind of told you some, kind of <laughs> saw some personal things about me the other day. I'd, I'd hate if you were to, you know, go spreading rumors about people. You know, it's against policy. Ooh, well, I mean, great. They're not rumors if they're true. Yikes. Uh, they're not true, though. What is going so, on here? I don't know. <laughs> great, one quick search in NCIC would prove that. Um. Okay, two and four. Two and four. Be sure to tell tonight after the traffic division. All right. So. The fuck is that? Let me go ahead and get some things pulled up here really quick. Of course. I believe there's some questions and stuff we got to go over throughout the process of this. Before we start, is there any specific questions that you might have for me? Uh, no, but I did want to say I appreciate you uh, training me. Yeah, of course. It's been a pleasure meeting you, Lieutenant. Absolutely. I had numb nuts. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> see, he walks slower. He doesn't Can you have... check and see if I'm in sheriff for you? Yeah, let me take shit ain't working. <laughs> You're not! <laughs> well, tell him to put me what in it. What the fuck? This fucking display is broke. It's a radar. Oh, okay. Okay, that's Dispatch really got you. Uh, Should I call 10-8? I Thank haven't you. had a chance to, so... No, not yet. We're gonna. I'm gonna go over everything with you here in just one second. All right. I'm gonna get my radio turned back up. We are still far, guys. We have not left. I turned it down for a second. So today's is patrol. I, I'm probably gonna keep the music off. We are gonna focus a lot more on my like, character development and just paying attention to uh, this this first patrol ride along. Um, that's what we're gonna mainly do is make sure we focus on learning and getting better as a deputy. That way, we can get up uh, get. Up on our own, and then we can focus more on, you know, chatting and whatnot. Uh, we're not gonna have a schedule and play the characters, but I do intend to play this character more consistently, and I might even add in a new streaming day for, uh, to play this character once or twice a week on streams. Um, she will have off duty days, All right, but those so will probably be recorded. I definitely recommend I don't know, uh, that yet. you take notes throughout this. This is kind of gonna be your first ride along, and throughout this, you are gonna be pretty much just shadowing me. Um, obviously. I might let you step into certain situations that I deem you could probably handle. Um, but for the most part, you're just going to kind of be watching and observing how things are done. Um, I am going to go over some of our basic policy and procedure, things that we kind of expect from you on the street. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, such as, you know, spreading I'm out, so maintaining guys. distance from everybody, so... uh, stuff like that. Um, and then periodically, I will ask you some questions, and I'll expect that you answer them. And if you can't, don't stress it. I'm I'm gonna make sure that I explain the correct answer to you, and ensure that you understand that. So, any other questions that you might have for me? I do not. All right, I'm going to get on the street. <laughs> yeah, we're about Valentino for the first day. Yep. Yeah. 216 County, 10 12 traffic, when ready. Oh my gosh. Are we just gonna be listening to the duck all day? <laughs> Fucking love that duck, dude. 10, and I thought I had trouble speaking English. <laughs> Thank you, Cap Rock, for the 5,000 bits. Again, the, you're being very generous today. I appreciate it a lot. But is your call uh, sign right? 221. Okay, good. I'm just making sure. Sometimes I get a little bit forgetful. No worries. Anywho, um,. Just a couple of basic questions about yourself, just to get to know you a little bit. Okay. What, uh, what made you choose the department? Who did you go into law enforcement? Uh, well, um, I'm not sure if you saw my documentations. I am married, and me and my husband ended up working in security back in our old, uh, we were abroad for a little while. Danger okay. zone! And I enjoy the uh, work, the line of work, and just wanted to see if it was something that would fit and so far during the training process i have enjoyed uh, being able to learn a little more about uh, leo and i think it fits fits me wanting to help people oh, that's great she's lying was it armed security or what kind of security were you in? i'm sorry 
Were you working armed security or was it unarmed? It was armed security, yes. Okay. Any like specific organization or was it just kind of like privately? Uh, it, it was it was a private security business and we uh, were hired quite often for big uh, for big jobs uh, such as you know, kind of. Is that the radar going off? Yeah. Is Sorry. there any way to turn that down from my perspective? Uh, I. <laughs> Give me one second. I don't know if that's just me. It's it's very loud in my ear. Yeah, give me one second. <laughs> Can you call it in? Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna. Gotta go for. My brother did one stuff. We got the traffic guy right here. So I've hey, already seen that happen. Do you guys want some extra so hands or? I think we ought to be good. Okay. All right. Yeah, rear ended and then. Looks like group six is decided to shoot somebody. Stay safe. Yeah, you as well. Uh, I'm gonna see if the radar can be turned down. Here. Let me take a look here at the actual radar itself right. and see what I can push it, for you. It's just super loud. I don't know if I'm able to turn it down for my sake or if it's you that has to do it. Um. So yeah, Harley Kavanaugh has a few things in her history. Again, they're not all completely so built, but you'll find out more about her over time. I'll tell you that. Yes, this character is indeed buried. Um, unfortunately, her husband is quote unquote you, out of state. Do you, right you have your ra uh, like radar in your eyes? Like you could see it. No, I was not. Uh, how do I go about um, doing that? I don't think you. I don't think you can. Yeah, I'm in the passenger side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, let me see if something that I can do can help you. <laughs> Harley, um, so yeah, you're probably wondering Kavanaugh. Um, Kavanaugh is, I think, yeah, an can Irish. You hear that? No. Okay. Kavanaugh is indeed, I think, an Irish name. Um, her grandmother was Irish, and she came from Ireland, and you know, settled with a family here. So she doesn't have an Irish accent. The only thing remotely Irish about her at this point is her having light green eyes. What certifications am I going to get? I'm aiming to get, right. do investigations. I, I want to uh, detective. K9 and Game Warden. It might just but be investigation sure, with K9, though. I don't know yet. I really want to do Game but, Warden. Um, anyways. So, <laughs> came from security. Armed security. Mm -hmm. Did you kind of did it abroad? Like another country? or? Yes, I uh, stayed abroad. I prefer to keep the countries to myself, but... Yeah, that's okay. <clears throat> it was uh, multiple countries, I will say that. We were often hired for, you know, like I said, big jobs. Uh, kind of similar to the Union Depository, they were uh, high-value things. Sometimes yeah. uh, things from, you know, museums that cost quite a lot. Sometimes they were gold bars. Other times, maybe high-value antiques or jewelry. That's kind of cool. Are you Were you born here? Or... Yes, sure? yes, I was... Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. I was actually born in New York State, um, but I have lived here about oh, okay. mm, 10, 12 years ago for a few years. I, I know the area. I remember it, and I wanted to come back to it because I enjoy it. Oh. Well, sounds like quite the past experience you got. <clears throat> yep. I think armed security will definitely help you in your law enforcement That's adventure here. I hope it does. Zone. We are still in FD, yes, guys. I'm gonna so stop your answering goals, questions like about that. What kind of goals you have set for yourself? What would you like to see yourself do? Well, um, personally for me, I would like to Danger save zone. enough money and once... Well, basically save enough money and, and get myself a nice place in the city. Right now I live in Polito. Um, okay. I just want to basically settle, settle myself here. Maybe have a family in the future, I don't know yet. Yeah. No, you said you had a you had a husband. You plan on moving him in with you down there? Um, well, I'm hoping he comes by soon. He is on a pretty long business trip right now. Uh, he's out of, out of oh, completely okay. out of country right now. He's on one of those security uh, detail jobs. Yeah. We're with Valentino. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will say he doesn't approve of me uh, doing this job, but he understands that I want to help people out. Is he just worried you might get hurt, or...? Yes, yes, he's very protective. 
I understand, yeah. Oh, it's so hard it's playing more serious very, character. It's a very risky job. <laughs> I mean. So I've heard. For a, quite a small county, I've heard there's quite a lot of trouble around here. Yeah, definitely. It's hard keeping it that low tone, waves, that's for like sure. more laid back, serious. She's she's not a hyperactive character at all, guys. I don't want to make it sound too bad, but I'm sure you can imagine some of the things we've seen around here. Oh, yes. I've uh, seen the newspaper, and I see quite a bit going on. Seems to be happening in the city a little more often, but yeah, the county uh, also has its uh, issues, I see. Yeah, yeah. I uh, that used to work getting out longer. The city for a while there. It's a lot more, much more <laughs> yeah. of a dense population, this so the crime rate's naturally going to be a little sus. higher down there. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now, for jurisdiction, obviously you guys are in the county, and then from my understanding, on the road or on the highway, that's the state. But then, of course, if we see uh, someone break the law while we're traveling, we can stop and handle that. Yeah, so um, this yawning. is actually kind of something we've covered in another policy that really doesn't apply to you yet yes valentino uh, i know i'm trying to be in character a vehicle policy which implies that uh while off duty conducting off duty you know endeavors in a department vehicle you are responsible to you know uphold that protect and serve that you swore an oath to do so if anything happens in front of you you do have the duty to intervene okay good to know um oh whoa Jesus. Alright. Yeah, I barely tapped him. He should be alright. He's probably <laughs> just sleeping. Probably just knocked down. <laughs> yeah, poor guy. Um, anyways, yeah, so basically you have I'm a sure duty to will. intervene. I'm sure you will. Um, obviously that comes with some stipulations and stuff like that, you know, like, if you're driving down, like, I don't know, you're, let's say you're in the city. I'm at 4012 and I see him going up the mountain at the moment. Kind of four, oh, it's a sieve right there. To that is a sieve. 70, huh? 67. I can't we'll see stop. the radar, so... Alright. Oh, I sort of got off. I had shot my first traffic stop, bro. I think I'm just shadowing today, though. I don't think I'm going out of the car. Uh... 10 for might be easier to help search for. Okay, yeah, see, this is... We already got a little traffic stop. I currently lost time. Oh, is that Bridget? Bridget? Oh my god, meeting Bridget. What was his uh, direction of travel? i for the air to clear. Mm -hmm. So we're not really gonna do much unless it's something very small, guys. I think right now for the first one he's gonna handle this. Thank god. Route 68. The radio's a bit low, we can go ahead and uh... Turn it a little low. The traffic. There we go. This can go in. Gonna be westbound Joshua. Here's across the marina, postal 3030, with a motorcycle occupied one time, no additional is required. RC316, sharing unit 11, please zero, please zero, westbound Joshua, road on a motorcycle, like a potential one. 17 from 34, do you want me to go activate Gabe Warren and uh, go grab a pickup? Uh, How does it feel yeah. riding with Valentino? I'm fine with it. Um, I'll be my character is very respectful of rank in general. It's her character, but in general I am as well. When I'm when I'm doing something completely new, I'm definitely going to yeah. be listening when to everything. Alright. Can I step out at least and just watch? Yeah, of course. I'll look careful that pole right there. But Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can approach the thing if you'd like. Yeah, I'll come up with, with my How's truck. it going? Uh, Lieutenant Valentino of the Blank County Sheriff's Department. Reason for Deputy. the stop, that's going 67 to 50 back there. You have your license, registration, proof of insurance. Uh, I'm hearing uh, my uh, radio uh, thing go through my okay. speakers. Do you have any firearms on you? Uh, yeah, pull them up back I'm about to fix right. that once we yeah, get you're trying to go ahead and reach for that. Just, uh, I, did sure I did not leave FD, guys. I did not leave FD. Hi. I'm gonna have to restart my Sonora cat on my um desktop. Here. Where are you at? Guys, I did not leave any departments. On top of the mountain. Oh, it's Kira. Okay. I've seen this Can character. Can you just confirm the first and last on this license? First and last name. Uh, it's gonna be Kira Huxley. <laughs> All right. Huxley. Huxley. Sounds good. 
kind of run our information, make sure everything comes back. Okay. I'm using LT. Of course, it's best. She's going to be observing this very intently, just watching. Um, but yeah, music is off today just because I'm focusing on learning right here. Oh, Prince kept what's in the car. Okay. We're just watching this lady make sure she doesn't pull out a weapon or something. What is she looking at? Oh, she's leaning. Oh, that's nice. I like that. Gonna do the arm cross. I don't want to because I'm afraid if she brings a gun out, it'll be hard to get out of that animation suddenly. That's why I'm not doing it. I do want to do it when it's more relaxing and whatnot. Go ahead and look over, so, you know, see what he's up to. He's probably looking up the, the, the person here. There's an MVA here. Theft. <laughs> I know it's push X to cancel, but you know, when you're suddenly getting shot at, you're not going to have time to think. Is there a cop idol? There we go. I don't really right, like this so one. This one's pretentious. Um, I feel I like this is a bit pretentious. I don't think you've ever really come into contact with It just makes me look really uninviting. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and issue a verbal warning as well as I am gonna let you know. Uh, when I was looking into the registration here of this motorcycle, it does expire today. So after today, the registration list is no longer gonna be valid. Um, and if you do get stopped without a valid registration, the bike could be towed. So I'd highly suggest after today making sure that you get that registration renewed. Um, body. She is wearing a body cam. Uh, uh the right. body cam options um, don't work with this back. belt. So I okay. we pretend that she has a body cam on her You're belt is what they said. And everything like that. So. Um. Other than that, I really don't have anything else for you. So. Uh, really quick, just before we take off, uh, you just mind taking your helmet off really quick, so I can see what you look like. Uh, yeah, I can. Lift your visor, whichever one. I'll just take off. 30, 17, you're <laughs> okay, I just want to make sure you're the person on your ID. Alright, yep, you were all uh, good to go. If you're in e so, uh, once I get back in, yeah, once I get back in my big point, lights turn off, you easy. are free to go. I did not leave any departments, guys. I'm about to put, like, a disclaimer. I did not leave anything. Okay, have a good day. Alrighty, you too. Probably out there, Red, so y'all get my custody. Alright, let's fix my cat here. I'm gonna reload my cat. I don't know if that's gonna fuck anything up. Uh, police. New dispatch. There we go. Joshua Road. Now I can hear it. It's pretty simple. Yeah. Do you have any questions about it? I do not. No, that's how I expected it to go, and it's good that she wasn't uh, gonna cause us any grief. Yeah. Just a lawful gun on her, so not mm. too terribly worried. Mm hmm. Is that something you normally ask, or is it only something you ask when you notice that they have a firearm registration? It kind of depends on the situation, the really, for me. Um, I it's that. more of like, I mean, I'll definitely ask Fire it if I SLT if I see a firearm registered for sure. But if I have a weird gut feeling, I'll ask the question just to ask it. If like something seems off about the traffic stop to me, I'll ask it. Um, that because typically when you ask that question, right even if they at. lie to you, you can kind of so read them. Mm, right, right. Um, so all these questions I ask guys, they are in-character questions. I generally know that I, most of the questions I'm going to ask, I generally actually already know the basic answer. I'm just asking it because I'm trying to RP out. Anyway, yeah, you Harley's can kind of learning. typically get a oh my what God. in the absolute fuck. I do not know. I... Seventeen for thirty-four. If you can, uh, yeah, looks a like a local. What a dumbass. Yeah. Jesus, fuck killed us. Anyways, um. Nice whew. sirens. Thank you. <laughs> it's kind of just a gut feeling thing. Oh yeah, or I do have new I sirens, fire, guys. I do have new sirens. Of sure. testing them out. Right. Just one of those harmless questions. I mean, I'm just gonna pretend she's taking notes. I I will probably will take notes on very special things, but um, right now I'm just learning on the job. So, um, I'm going to ask you a quick question here. Right. Are you ever authorized to leave county jurisdiction? And if so, what precautions should you take prior to doing so? Give me one moment here. 
here. Okay. Um, thank you, Cop Rock, for the five thousand. But the main question there. is, your siren better than my siren? In terms of leaving the show, direct station, uh, direct station, direct. Oh my gosh, English. In order to leave the county area, I'm just gonna say that. Uh, you would need to, first of all, it'd have to be if you're called out to it, or if you're needed there, say in the city or on the highway. And if so, you need to get permission from both a supervisor from BCSD and uh, the fellow jurisdiction that you're going to, a supervisor from them. Very good. Um, some additional things that you might have to go down to LSP jurisdiction for are like, um, Bro, like thank investigations you again for the after bits, concludes, dude. Really, uh, really nice today. I... hospital if they're taken there. Small stuff like that. Uh, not necessarily calls, but things that Convict are just part of your everyday job you might have to commute down for. Mm -hmm. um, I'll, uh, try to and then, uh, obviously, um, yeah, thank you, thank you so to go down there, again. you'd request from um, a supervisor from us, and then I need, I need to put a disclaimer that I didn't leave any departments. Request entry permission from an LSPD supervisor. All right. What about things like, uh, I know that sometimes I've heard of Elio giving courtesy rides to maybe, you know, someone walking down the highway or something. What is yeah. the protocol on that? Um, so typically, when you're given a courtesy ride, it's just you pick them up. You're like, all right, you know, call it out on the radio. So, you know, uh, 221, I'll be given a courtesy ride to blah, blah, blah from okay. here to here. Um, and then you would advise the incoming jurisdiction supervisor that you're entering their jurisdiction with a courtesy ride. I'm just going to RP out and everything. And before you ever approve the courtesy ride with that subject, um, you would request from our supervisor, just, you know, for example, 216, uh, any BCSD supervisor, am I going to give XYZ a courtesy ride to XYZ? And then before you put them in your car, make sure you pat them down for weapons, anything like that. Of course. All right. Um, so yes, guys, they refuse, I, like a pat down, then thank you for the follow. I am a deputy now. Again, I'm new to, find to it, get so down to where they're going. please do not judge what I do. I'm gonna make mistakes, it's gonna fucking happen. Let my trainers handle it. Alright. Um, I'm gonna be playing in character as much as I can while learning. Um, Dangerous thank you very much for the follow there, I appreciate that. What about you? Why did you join the BCST? Well... Um... Better question probably why did I get into law enforcement? I've been around so many different agencies. Uh, I'm kind of just trying to find where my where I fit in the most. <laughs> Honestly, I just um, I like helping people. I mean, it comes down to that and being able to some, keep the streets clean of people who don't I don't belong. know. We're not on some. Um, we're not on a scene crime. right now. That's one of my main passions when it comes to law enforcement is violent crime. Um, I I you know I can't stand it. I think. I said you BCSD. Know, it, it I needs to be BCSD punished. And BCSD. Yeah, so it's something that I really, uh, really pushed me, I guess, to join law enforcement one. as a whole. That's, that's very nice. Yeah. Plus, kind of my my parents growing up really. I mean, I didn't really live the oh, best life the growing up. Right I didn't have the the best guidance. So, you know. Oh, Valentino! I'd be the change in the family. I think that's actually quite noble of you. I actually grew up in a pretty um, wealthy middle-income family, and I got everything I needed to. Yeah. So I can't say I had the same plights as you. I mean, when when it comes to things like this, it doesn't matter where you start. I mean, if you put your mind to it, you can do anything you want to do. And there you I, go. I stand by that 100%. Good fucking words, Valentino. Um, I, I, from from very early on, I was very motivated to be different than everybody else. You know, um, a lot of my family was involved in uh, like doing drugs and a lot of other stuff. So, from very early on, I was, you know, highly against it, just because of, you know, it being morally wrong, and that's what society teaches us. Right. And I just kind of, I didn't want to be that, that kid who grows up and then does exactly <laughs> what his parents does and did. Yeah, that's, uh, I know my father wanted to, uh, well, to have me become the typical lawyer or doctor and I uh, chose not to. I wanted to do something else. 
Uh, yeah. At a I mean, gas station just that's, a, that's another thing, too, the, that people don't uh, understand. It's like the, 68, uh, the hardships might be different for, for people of different social classes, I guess. Oh there God, is I definitely still hardships because, like you said, you know, your parents like, wanted you to do something a lot more. I guess quote prestigious. Again, I thought my English is bad going today. Out on the street and being nice and mean at the same cop. time. Ha ha ha. But at the end of Since the day, you, you say don't judge you on your first day, I'm others, judge so you. I need I to break pretty, this sad story. Valentino is making me cry. Mm. Damn you, Good Valentino. Guess. So, I guess you would consider yourself a very moral person then. I like to be. I like to say that. Uh, you can hop out and talk to me. I'm just gonna swipe the department card. Kind of yes. Um, thank you very much, Coprock, for the 5,000 oh, like bits once again. Oh my gosh, thank you um, so, so, so much, and... I... Yeah, you can judge me, but not how I do my work. Time. I just, I don't like being an asshole. But I'm more of a... I like to return the energy someone gives me. So if someone's, you know, if someone's very uptight and rude with me, I might not be completely rude, you know, or an asshole and make myself look like a clown. But I'll, I mean, I could definitely hit back in another area and if it's you know for example a felony arrest i could you know push all the charges that apply and then you know if someone's compliant with me like for example i pull somebody over and they have like a a small baggie of methamphetamine or something like that and they're honest about it i mean i have the discretion there to if i want to i could cite them and let them go or if i want to i could take them to jail and so at that point it's where that person's attitude comes into play because if you're a dickhead mm -hmm. to me I'm more inclined to take you to jail than let you go. So. Uh, if you're not That's you interesting. Have you wrote down four zero one one for a supervisor request mm. in relation to staff sergeant? Is that in our area? Tina. Uh, hold on. Now uh, that mail that we were trying to tell earlier, sir, he's requesting the highest ranking supervisor currently, and he's requesting you. No, oh, I guess not. Is there another supervisor on the scene? That's clear. 217, how are you doing? Uh, different one, I guess. Sixty. are electric shock. That Ooh, that would have been interesting. <laughs> Thank you, we'll Far CDB, for the, uh, the resubscription. I appreciate area. that a lot. Sorry if I'm a little that's distracted, guys. I am trying that's to actually get a story going out of this. So, this as always, um, I've always just had a yeah, moral, or maybe it's more ethical than moral, yeah, but. When you decide to choose to treat someone differently based on their attitude, when they've had the same, you know, they've done the same wrong thing, why why choose to treat someone differently based off of how they're acting with you? Well, um, the reason for that is we're here, we're not we're not here to make your day bad, and when I'm very respectful of someone, I can understand if I was that that dickhead cop, you know, who is like. An asshole from the get-go. Of course, you're gonna get that same energy back from anybody you try that with. Down to meet medical on 68. Copy. Um, but at the end of the day, it's the people who purposely put you through kind of an extended amount of, I, for lack of a better term, shit, because they either think that they're above the law. I don't know where he's or, going. Or you know. Thank you very much for the congratulations. That, they hate law enforcement and I, it's again it's very discretionary because i can understand someone being in a bad mood because of you know something that just I happened i am drinking them. pepsi and i yeah. will try to talk to people like i don't drink soda I'm very often gonna, but as soon as they're I, a dickhead I with me i'm like some. all right well you're getting charged it's more like hey man look i'm trying to work with you you know i'm willing to help you out here i'm willing to you know give you a break i just need you to work with me and you know not make my job a living hell and a lot of people will take that and be like, you know what? But I respect that. And they'll stop what they're doing. They'll reassess the situation. And know they'll, you know. But yeah, my unit not, not a, I mean, not all right the time now. they will be like, I'll give you everything you want. But they might lose the attitude and be a little bit more cooperative with you. And then you have the people who are like, yeah, well, fuck you. You're a piece of well, shit. I hate you. And want to make your job living hell. And we'll do everything to drag out the process of justice. And those are the people that let it's me like, fix that unit location you know, thing very quickly i i have a discretion whether or not i want to charge you with everything or i can i can't you know for go. example it's a, if it's a big felony arrest i can't drop the main i think felonies, i got rid of the unit drop location small things and make your time a little bit easier you know um 
because we know the judicial system is convict. Yes, guys. not necessarily easy. And so having to go through that for a ton of charges and having to go through that for one or two charges is a lot different. So it's more of to implement that mindset. Hey, if you work with the police, they'll work with you. All right. I definitely understand the reasoning why you might treat, you know, someone with a little more kindness if they treat you with the same. Yeah, and at I the mean, same like I said, time, I would understand. Right. At the same time, I would understand if somebody wanted to treat everyone equally because, in the end, they did break the law. Right. I mean, I just I don't like being mm -hmm. one of those cops who, you know, if someone's cooperative with me, I'm not one of those cops who's gonna who's gonna rack you up on charges. You know, if. You got a little bit of weed or something on you, and you're like, hey, I got I a little bit of weed on me. You know, and you're honest it. about it, then, hey, look, you know, it's not a big deal. It's a little bit of weed, you know? I'm not going to put you through the whole system and fuck you over for, for a little bit of weed. Tonight. Right, right. But if you want to be an asshole and hem me up over a little bit of a weed, you know, I mean, come on. Oh, it's, it's like, if you're going to do that, then Ms. Barner there's going to be consequences that come with it, because there is consequences for your actions, you know? Of course, always. See what they're up to over here. This guy's some sort of sovereign citizen. Oh um, no! <laughs> he was the guy that. This I is getting into some good RP. That's what I want with this. This is what I want out of this character. I want to bring back that more in game RP, and I think I'm doing that really well. I love this. So. Got him in the cuffs, got him in the back of my vehicle, brought him down here. He's requesting my supervisor, so. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, we'll talk to him. All right, so the unit located. The you're going to come up with me if you want. Of course. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so the unit location, I guess if I'm roaming, right, no, I, I wonder if there's a way if I can do roaming, it I'm goes good. off, and when I'm not uh, roaming, it, can, it goes staff through. Staff okay. Yeah. <clears throat> What's going on, sir? Lieutenant Valentino, the Blaine County Sheriff's Department. How can I help you? This is a phony stop under the color of law. You're not supposed to arrest people under under phony stops. Under that phony stops? Phony. This is oh, yeah, phony. <laughs> right. Phony. <laughs> phony or felony? Oh my god, you almost got hit right there. Phony. F H P H O N N uh, whatever. I know what you're talking about, yes. Okay. So, um, I do have a vest. It's an under vest, what makes you I think guess. This, is, this might be a phony stop. Because I but I do have an I have an under vest under that I'm allowed to use. So I have a little bit of body body stuff. I cannot be stopped uh, for means of convenience. I'm using that well, for means of convenience. Right, sir. Well, unfortunately, we're not stopping you from your means of convenience. We're stopping you in relation to a crime that you committed, I and that crime was shoplifting. Crime. I did not commit such a crime. I do not need ID since I live on my own land. Okay. I do not recognize the rule of the U.S. Constitution. Alrighty. Well, unfortunately, <laughs> um, that's not how the law works. I mean, I don't really know how I'm going to go into depth here and explain to you how the law works, but there, there's no such thing as not recognizing the U.S. Constitution. As long as you're not on your own property, you are on the rules of us. You, you play by our rules. All right. I, I do not. I was on my own property. I was on the bike. That's my property. Right, but the crime you committed wasn't on your own property, sir. And that's where you have to understand. Once you commit a crime and flee into the convenience of your own property is where we have jurisdiction to come onto your property and do what I'll we I'll answer need. questions later, guys. I We're listening not, to this. I do not respect or acknowledge your rule. This is... You guys have set up a phony government. Okay. Well, I mean, that's something that you're going to have to take up with the government and not myself. I mean, I'm, I'm simply a deputy. Oh, I will. Trust me. I will, I'll be filing a lawsuit. <laughs> What? Okay. How can he file a lawsuit if he doesn't believe in the law? <laughs> you can't file a lawsuit if you don't believe in the laws. Okay. Alrighty. Well, I will see you in court then. Um, I mean, is there any Body other concerns you have for me? I have no clue. That's just an issue with that. This situation? This is a phony stop. I I'm not going to say that to him. Right now. I will say okay, it to Valentino, well, though. According to the policies of Blaine County Sheriff's Department, this is not a phony stop. and There's nothing that I can do to enforce that on my deputy as well as my staff sergeant over there. I'll, I'll stick around, just in case he acts up again. So once again, is there anything else that I could do for you? Yeah. Get me out of these cuffs. Well, I, I can't do that. I gotta go. 
All right, well, you're, I mean, as of right now, you're going to jail. Yikes. I want to say to him, but I'm, I'm going to, she That's might say sweet. it to someone if she's on At her own. Day, I don't think I she'd say it in front of her supervisor. supervisor. My staff sergeant's discretion to take you into custody for something that you did. <laughs> Listen, dude, you need to stop. You're going to make the situation a hell of a lot worse for yourself, and you're going to get yourself either hurt or you're going to get some extra charges. All right. And if you want to go back home to your property, I'd suggest that you cool it, take a deep breath, and take this up the legal way and not try going about this in a way that's going to get you yeah, I feel like, get you extra charges. I feel like Harley's going to be closer to how Les deals with things. She's serious. Okay. She doesn't well, She doesn't want to take I, shit. Like I said. She would definitely make that comment if there were no supervisors around. Um, like, how are you going to file a lawsuit on, on, you you know, on us if, if you, you don't even crime, believe in the laws? And that's what's going on here today. So unless there's anything else that I can help you with, then I'm going to hand you back off to my staff sergeant and let him continue his work. Her walk okay. style is more confident. Nice on when she's alone, she might walk differently, but when she's, yeah, when yeah, she's on good. scene, Just she's has a more, more you know, confident. Yeah, I, I mean, I've heard his spiel from other people a thousand times. An so apid, it paces his da 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 da. An apid. So. Yep. Oh, I missed I mean, that. You, Where is this? I, I, I trust I that you got the burden this. of proof. You get him for shoplifting, so I'm not even gonna. Um, I have the. Witness testimony, which gives me some suspicion right, right now. I just have game, you can I'm not uh, officially APID. taking the ID. Rest. I'm moving in. Okay. Okay. What? I mean, I, seven, well, Myra, so like I said, I have that statement. Oh, oh ooh, you know, okay. okay. And then Hayes in the cast. Out, so. He was under Miranda when he admitted it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. my God. Thank you. Him, Thank you, I mean, Brian, yeah. for that. We're going to go down to the store. I'm going to talk to the shop owner, see what he wants to do about it, get some CCTV, and then go from there so okay yeah well uh i mean at this point i'm giving you the go ahead let me see here let me get fixed I mean, really quickly for something different just um, let him know that he's already spoken to a supervisor he's not gonna have it on. let's do unit location back bring okay. that back up okay well i'm gonna get back out of here then you guys stay Shit. safe yep. i'll uh, fi montana. fix that in just a sec appreciate it yep. see you montana all right let's <laughs> go ahead and head down to the harmony 24 7 so, how is this uh, person going to file a lawsuit if they don't even believe in the laws that you're trying to enforce? That's the point. <laughs> <laughs> they won't. They won't file a lawsuit. And, I mean, they'll try it, but okay, it, it'll get thrown out before it ever goes to, a, goes to a court floor. Cat setting. I mean, APPID. as stupid as this. Where is the APPID thing? Um, Brian, save... Is that system? Plus, I doubt he has a lawyer to represent himself if he doesn't believe in the law. I don't know why he would have a lawyer. Oh, I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it. Right. I'm gonna take just one moment inside my head here. Sorry. Okay. Okay, AP- God damn it. Cons- 1-1. 1-1. 1-1. Two, ah! A, B, D, B, 64. I think I got it right. Okay, I think I got that set now. Yes. Now is it working is the question. I guess we'll see in a sec. Let me get back to... Yep, it's working? Yes! Thank you very much, Brian, for setting that up. Alrighty, I was just, uh... Fixing the cat up just a little bit. No, you're fine. <laughs> How many times do you run into sovereign citizens around here, do you think? Oh, uh, it's not too yeah, often. Yeah, it's awesome. It's a, it's a... I'd say a pretty rare occurrence, <laughs> but... When you do, you get enough of them for a couple months. Change my status. I don't change it. The um, uh, dispatch does. Right. I, I see. I had another question, but now I forgot it. Give me a moment to think about it. That's fine. Uh, fuck. I think it was in relation to, it was in relation to kind of the morals and ethics of you know handling different people in different ways. Carry two and four. 
That is a very festive looking person, but now I forgot it. Maybe if I think about it, we'll go back to it. Yeah, we can. Uh, Alright, so... Are you ever allowed to self intentional call? And if so, can you give a circumstance where it would be allowed? Uh, the only circumstance at this point in time with my rank, it would only be an on-all call, uh... Calls, such as an officer down, shots fired. Right. Um, yeah. So, any sort of 1099 officer down situation you can mm -hmm. self-attach to. Basically how that works is, in a situation of a deputy Copy down, everybody down. available is going to respond that way. Whoever's first on scene will have the radio. Basically, the, nobody else should be talking on the radio. First on scene will have it. And right the first on scene is going to dictate how many more units they need where you know and what they need to wear and that'll determine whether or not you continue your sponsor step it down okay and then in terms of all calls if someone comes on the radio stream and all call then you're gonna head that way until someone tells you otherwise all right nice thank you brian oh, i'm seeing that that it's working that thank you so much as that's well. awesome this is amazing um so i want to bring all right what about a panic button i assume if a panic usually it does mean officer yeah. down um but what's panic button not... would just it just okay. panic buttons typically just classify as an officer down. So, Anytime a panic button's hit, we consider it a 1099. With so we'll still same procedure. Everybody rolls that way first on scene has the air. Or I mean, if that deputy gets control back of the situation they're in and can get the air, then that's they can get it and let it you know let us know in the area what they need. Um, but if they hit their panic button, and go on responsive first on scene as the dictator. What happens? Okay. Um, so I do want to say, guys, uh, I do want to actually give a special thank you to Sonora Cat. They actually ended up, uh, uh writing, reaching out to me and giving me this overlay. What for, is the for, mandated for cap for how many deputies my you can have here. on shift? So, I, so I, do, I do appreciate, um, the generosity from them, and it's, it's quite amazing. Sorry, what was the question? The mandated cap on how many deputies we can have on shift at a given point in time. On a shift at a given time, um... I don't think I was ever told that on training, but uh, I, I think it's 9 or 12. It's 12. Um, 12. We can have 12 okay. on, yep, 12 on at a time. That doesn't include K9s. Mm -hmm. um, and... I'm not showing you the fleet, guys. Uh, not right now. lifts after an hour and a half in your shift. Mm -hmm. I think I'm thinking about uh, maybe the state's cap, but I knew it was either, yeah, yeah. either or. Central, 234. Um, so in the time, how, how do you know... Is it basically first come first serve in terms I'll of the be cap? 10, yeah. Six. Okay. And, I'll be I mean, supervisors 10, don't have any sort of special immunity when it comes to cap. We're the, under the same mandate as everyone else, so. Right. Uh, yes, yeah, Sonora Cad did contact me and gave yep. me the overlay. Um, again, thank you very much for it because it's fucking awesome. Uh, so here, it a little bit of it really for a second. brings a little more to my Elio and Fire experience. It's a nice spot. Yep, I've never sat here before, so hopefully we get somebody. I'm tired of talking to you. Um. All right, are we allowed to run radar on freeways? Only if you're in um, the traffic-related division. I don't remember what it's called. Yeah, um, it's just the traffic enforcement division. That's it. Overly is in the top right corner, guys. All right. Um. What is an all call? What do you mean ahead, by sir. that? Like what? In, in a general Jesus. Oh my. In a general like consensus. What what defines an all call? Oh, goodbye, Prius. Do you mean what is considered an all-call? Like when it calls, or just what happens no, during no. an all-call? What happens during an all-call? Uh, during all-call, I radio, I assume one, there's gonna be a signal 100, uh, radio should be clear for all important traffic, and then all-call would be every single unit that is available needs to head over to, um, the scene of the, the scene of the crime, of course, if, I assume if you're on a basic traffic stop, and not on a severe call, then you can probably clear from that as well and head over. Yep, perfect. 
Alrighty. And when are you allowed to use your carbine? Danger rifle? zone. Ooh, this is a good one. Um, during an active shooter. Um, I'm not so sure about a specific traffic stop in terms of a code five. I assume if you're an assisting code five personnel, that's when you bring it out. And that's what I saw in the training. Right. Um, so typically, uh, anytime you're authorized by a supervisor to do so, you can bring it out. Mm -hmm. And personally, I would say that in any situation where you're alone and you feel it will be necessary, I mean, you mm -hmm. can you can bring it out. So uh, say say there is an active shooter and it's my duty to go in and, you know, because people are under threat, I can pull it out without any sort of... Yeah, I would say uh, so. Okay. Um, this is awesome. I love this. Be any other questions about that? Uh, during the whole Code 5 thing, uh, again, during my training, obviously, since I was the quote-unquote first officer on scene, I used my pistol, but is, is that something that's correct? Is if I'm assisting on a Code 5, that's when I can also bring it out, or is that also based on supervisory request? Um, personally, I'm going to be honest. I, I, I'm i going to need to get a little bit of clarification on this myself. There we go. I Asking the important questions. have seen people pull their carbines out and stuff like that it's not really something that we look into like uh why'd they have their carbine out um it's more of like discretion i guess um because i know if you're sru as a senior deputy <laughs> and you get on a scene you're able to rack an mp5 pregnant test comes discretion. back positive the and if fuck? i remember correctly you can rack a carbine at your discretion too if you feel it's necessary um but I, I mean, you're for sure good to do it anytime. Like we come on the radio, all right, carbine's authorized. Uh, that's definitely a given time where you're going to have your carbine out. But I mean, any situation you feel like having a rifle with a bit longer distance would, you know, aid you and you have a good reason to take it out then go for it, I'd say. All right. Um... When are exterior plate carriers around are allowed? Those are just vests, exterior vests. Ooh, I'm gonna be honest, I have no clue. <laughs> um, so at your rank, I have no you clue. can only wear an exterior vest on casual Fridays or casual Saturdays, or when authorized on a high priority call by a supervisor. Okay, so the vest you have then, you've got to be supervisor and above, or when you're. Uh, it's permission. corporal and above. Corporal, Corporal and above can wear it um, all the time. Otherwise, it's just when given permission or on casual Friday and Saturday. Okay. Cool. I didn't know that, actually. <laughs> I don't um, remember reading that anywhere. Why is it important to follow chain of command? Uh, it's, in my opinion, it's very important because, you know, when you become part of the chain of command... Um, if someone skips over you as a sergeant, it kind of is a slap to their rank and to the uh, hard work that they put in getting into it. So it's important to follow that. That way sergeants get their experience in helping, uh, you know, their subordinates out. And obviously if they can't help them at the time, that's where you go up the chain. But I believe in my opinion that if you gain a chain of command rank, that people should respect you for it and go to you first. Perfect. Yes, BCSD, um, best. Central, copy, stop. Casual Friday, Saturday, Corporal and above. I'll be... And permission I'll be on the dirt road of Smoke Tree and Panorama. <laughs> uh, times one vehicle. La... Unknown occupancy. I want to have... Sounds like he's been running. Yeah. Central, yeah. 254, Shania, on 1130, on a dirt road uh, near Smoke Tree... Road and it's a nice uh, spot. I like uh, this. Vehicle, yep, we got a new character, guys. For those who are here a little later, this is uh, Deputy Harley Kavanaugh. Oops, she is uh, my new character in general. She's going to be both off duty and on duty. Uh, she's she's got a whole backstory to her and a storyline that she's going to be going through.
So have you been in any other departments as law enforcement? Yeah, so like I said a little bit earlier, I um, I worked down in LSPD for a little bit. It wasn't too long. How am I doing before I I'm doing good. I realized drunk? that I kind of wanted to come back up to the county. But um, initially, when I first, very, very first got into law enforcement, I worked up in the county. Um, and then I kind of went doing my own thing for a while. Kind of just, you know, stopped getting law enforcement. I focused on myself for a little bit. Oh, my God. And then when I got back into it, oh, I like, decided thank you for the that I would bits. go pursue I was so focused on a state listening. agency. Mm -hmm. So I worked with the state for a little bit as a trooper. And then I transferred out of state for a little bit <laughs> to another state and worked there for Thank a little you very bit. Much. Realized I, I didn't really that. like it. It just wasn't for me. It, you know, I didn't really like the way the state was laid out, I guess. I don't, I don't know. I just a lot mm. of snow, shit like that. I just wasn't a big fan. You don't like snow? Um, and not really. Not a big fan of the snow. That's fair. Do we, does this place get snow? When back when I was here about ten years ago, it never snowed, but I know that it the climate is changing. So it's just perfect it, time. It, I get not snow here. Yet. No, it's just very. It's not, you know, all like all the time. Like some places I'm in the I'm gonna ask him all dude, these personal questions. Yeah, I want to get to know snow. everybody more personally. I, I'm not a fan really of that. Do. Like the whole. Yeah, we're getting twelve oh, feet of snow like today. Ocean. Like a little bit of snow Past. is all right. I just don't like that much snow. So that's why I kind of came. I said, no, no, no. Like that, I'm coming back home. So I came back, hung out a little bit, decided, you know what? I I mean, I guess I'm going to ask well me a question that might what I'm good at doing. bite him a little. <laughs> um, the only real opportunity okay. open for me at the time was the Los Santos Police Department. And so I, you know, I took it. And I what honestly, I'm going to be uh, honest, like, this is going to sound a little. Thank you. Hold on. 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 Oh, anyway, yeah, so I, uh, I went for the city. I really, I didn't think that I was going to enjoy it, and it's not because, you know, vroom, 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 vroom. anything wrong with the city. I just, I I'm not a stop now. at a red light here, stop at a red light there kind of guy either. I don't really mm -hmm. like the whole stopping for red light, stop and go, and stop and go. Thank you very I much, like Pop Rock, for the 2,000 bits there. I appreciate that So I worked on there for a while, and I mean, I enjoyed it more than I thought I would have. I probably shouldn't have said Ocean Pass because you might have wanted to tell you guys your story. Oops, whatever. I Oops. Kind of, I got to talking to some guys up here in the county, and they were like, you know, whoopsie. Oh, I I think that you'd Sorry, be a good up here. So I put in a put in a transfer and came up here. I was really hesitant because, you know, I didn't know how it was going to go for me. And Get sniper ready. What the fuck there, is I was going on? Very uneasy. But then once I finally got my footing, I I don't think I'd ever go That's anywhere else. Mm -hmm. Do you have any family here? Um. Well, for a while my parents lived here, but they kind of got old and I, I, wanted to retire, I and so they moved oh, well. down to moved down to Florida, which is just a, a typical thing to do. Mm -hmm. Um. Are you scared yet? She's actually coming I mean, in it is from Florida season. sometime in the next couple of weeks. And she's going to be living here. Really? Yeah. And, um... I wonder who's... who's I mean, I guess I can't, I'm I in a relationship, sister. but... Oh, really? Well, I don't want to pry too much if you don't want to, but... That's no, good no, to hear. It's, it's fine. But, um... Yeah, I mean... Is it with no, pretty just, much the I only real family I'm going to have here... It's gonna be my thank sister you, here in the next couple Alex, weeks, but for the twenty five hundred bits, that's no, no, thank you, thank you so much. I have uh, a daughter. You did scare me a bit. Thank you for that. Right. Have you and your sister been close for a while? 
Um, That's awesome that he's getting someone to play his sister, dude. That's... I don't really know. <sighs> My sister's very... I don't really like some of the choices she makes. She's a very interesting person, in my opinion. And uh, her choice of relationship doesn't really make me too happy. But um, I'm just watching all these cars. There's not really much I can do about off. it, just due to some conflict of interest stuff that I'm not really going to get into. Uh, you said that he has a he's dating. I'm someone. sure if you find out, you'll find out. But right. Oh, does she plan to join uh, the law enforcement? Uh, no. No, no. She's nice. more of like a... I don't know. She, Like I said, I don't really like some of the decisions she's made, so... She kind of just does her own thing. Right. Did you do anything prior to becoming law enforcement, or were you just straight out of high school? I mean, like I said, I grew up aspiring to do law enforcement, so pretty much straight out of high school. I mean, I had the typical high schooler job, working, you know, minimum wage. I gotta make, I gotta make, like, joint, remember everything about everybody here. It's gonna be great. After that, and I was old enough to do this, I kind of, you know, hit the ground running and came straight to what I wanted to do. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm sorry, could you say that again? I had a very loud thing go That's off okay. in my ear. Yeah. If, uh, if a signal 100 goes on to the radio, what does that mean? Uh, that means priority traffic to the scene that is dedicated to the signal 100. Perfect. Uh, sorry, copper guy. I did um, uh, pause that for a second. When you're driving off road on like a three thousand pits, how fast should you second. really be going? Well, that is dependent on your vehicle. Um, if I remember correctly, all these low rider vehicles, like the Charger, the Crown Vic, um, you should keep it relatively slow in order to not kill off the suspension and the wheels. Uh, I don't remember the specific. Uh, for a situation. Uh, I, I don't. Again, thank you very much, Coprock, for the 3,000 bits. Sorry I had to mute that. I didn't need to listen to the questions. So, Metro for an active hostage situation. Uh, State and Metro are all attached. Hmm, interesting. Supervisor, they request us. We are not going to probably um, be So just to clarify, it's uh, it's technically 45. Sometimes yeah. you're going to go a little bit over that by accident. I wasn't I wasn't you finished with my ad. Okay, go under that for sure. Just try to keep it around 45. Right. Yeah, I, was, I wasn't done answering, but you interrupted me. No, that's my bad. I apologize. But, uh, I assumed it was going to be around 45, 50. Um, but yeah, I understand that vehicles like the SUVs and pickups will be able to go faster. All right. I'm going to try to get these questions knocked out really quick just in case something goes on. Um, mm -hmm. What is a pursuit commander? Pursuit Command is in charge of calling out pretty much all this. Sh uh, call sorry, calling out um, in terms of what additionals are needed onto the pursuit. Um, honestly, basically just figuring where everyone needs to be at that time. I don't know the specifics of that. Oh, uh, yeah, pretty I much. Um because I know that call-outs are done by the secondary, so... Yeah. So pretty much Pursuit Commander, I mean, yeah, like you said, they are designating where people are and what people are doing. Um, they oh, typically they're... are the... Yeah, I was going to say they are They are also the ones that get to decide uh, what measurements to take when stopping, you know, stopping a vehicle. Very good, yes. Um, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, you pretty much got that head on there. Um, they are typically the highest ranking in Pursuit. Sometimes it's going to change. Obviously, for example, if a sergeant takes pursuit command and I get into pursuit and the sergeant has more information on the pursuit than me, I'm not going to take it from him because mm -hmm. he's got the most information and I trust, you know, I trust him to make the call. Now, if I get in pursuit and like a deputy, deputy one who's primary has it and they're not quite sure what to do, then, you know, one of us will try to get the, you know, proper information we need. And then somebody from the supervisory team you got something will probably man? take pursuit command on that pursuit. Um, and then, the last the thing that I have zone. for you is who uh, can you terminate really a well. pursuit? That is going to be the pursuit commander. 
And then, um, based off of that, I know that terminations are based off of weather, increments, uh, speed, and uh, basically how dangerous the person is driving as well. I, again, that goes in correlation with the speed. Um, I assume, though, no matter what, that it, uh, it's up to the pursuit commander whether they want to terminate it. I don't think any uh, non-pursuit command can terminate it, unless you're maybe a supervisor and above, I assume. Yeah, exactly. I think Jerry's drunk a little bit. All right. Now, all we got left to do is kind of just drive around and see what gets assigned to us for the rest of the night. Right. So how do you like working with everybody else? I've only really, you know, met you and and uh, Staff Sergeant Myron, I think it was. Well, um, I mean, I Captain. personally... Hold on. I want to see what this dispatcher has to say. Mm -hmm. She's trying to, like, get to know everyone. She wants to know everyone, their personalities, what they do, you know, how, what their life is about, why they're doing law enforcement, everything. She's an information right. whore, which um, is why I want to be a detective. Like I said, like I was saying, um, I think everybody here is really great. I think there's <laughs> definitely a lot of really good people. You're not drunk? A okay. lot of very good personality traits here. Um, everybody's got their own specialty, and that's something that's really nice, because you always got someone who can, you know, do what you need, no matter what it is, for the most part. Awesome situation. Everybody's a really good working team. None of us really have any conflicts with each other. I mean, there are the occasional arguments here and there, but it's Detective nothing that... Kavanaugh. Is that stop sounds us good, from being able to work together. That sounds sexy. Mm -hmm. Toronto clear from stop. I'll be back tonight. I'm happy to. Watching well, I'm hopeful to hopefully meet everybody else at some point. Get oh yeah, you definitely will. But what are the uh, rules in regards to going back to station? You know, in the middle of a shift. I assume obviously for reports, but what happens if you're sitting out for, say, thirty minutes, nothing happens, go back to station for just a short while for a break? Yeah, I mean, um, I'd honestly say it's kind of encouraged. Get to know your fellow deputies, stuff like that. A couple of them will hang yeah, around the station. You're detective. more than welcome to pop in there when it's slow and just be like, you know, I hang out for a few shit. minutes, get a cup of coffee, you know, grab a snack, whatever you please doing. Right. Uh, if you got a report you can write, you can do that. Very nice. <laughs> well, it seems like I've been asking you a lot of questions. You got any for me in terms of m myself? Probably. I don't know if I should make my way back towards the station or not. That way I'm close if this hostage situation goes out. Mm. And if it does, where am I going to be in regards to that? I don't think I'm exactly uh, trained for something like that. What'd you say? Uh, if there is a hostage additional required um, and, I, and we go, uh, what's going to be my duty in regards to it? Um. Well, for... Because I'm not trained to uh, activate right. an SRU or whatever it was. Most likely what I'll have you doing is some sort of perimeter work, making sure that the perimeter is secure. Um, okay. Just ensuring that if there is a perimeter that a, nobody's coming in or out of it who doesn't need to be. Okay. Perfect. What vehicles do I want to drive? I don't actually know. I could see her being a pickup kind of girl because she is more of a county girl, gal. Um, she does like the city as well. She's a pretty unique and complex character in my opinion, so it'll be hard. Now, I will say I do have an interest in detective work. Uh, when am I able to potentially... Well... Um as soon as you're power to all units yeah. and en route towards the area of public field medical center 8040 okay. uh metro and state are requesting assistance all units stand up for 10 one oh shit all right Six, thank we'll, you uh... Utah, who, and we'll have a bearcat on standby somewhere in the area Six, i'll go ahead and leave that question for later oh what'd you say i'll go ahead and leave that question answered for later that's fine Looks like we're gonna do it for a check. Let's go. Um, no, I can answer it. Sorry, uh, Deputy One. As soon as you're done with your probie phase and you're graduated Detective on Deputy One, you'll be able Kavanaugh. to express interest on in that. T totally doing that. All right. 
New sirens also, guys. This is the uh, sheriff ones. I may play around with them a little more because they don't have the rumbler. Oh my god, it's a cow. And he switches his sirens. See, a fire people, you switch your fucking sirens so they don't get boring. Valentino does that. Thank you, Valentino. If they're quiet, I can just turn up the setting. I do need to turn some of them up, though. Uh, this is voice chat. Where is... That's all I can really do about it. I'm not gonna use my AR, no. I'm just gonna be doing a promoter check. I don't think I'm gonna be using the carbine. Oh my god. I think his eyes are dying a bit. We got a hostage situation. My very first day. We're doing an all call. Pretty much. You're not gonna move. Alright. Yeah, it's a big truck. Hard to move him. Oh my god, my eyes are. Jesus Christ. I got some bits. I have no clue where I got it from. I've been at a banquet this evening. Still in my suit and banquet. not done for the night. Ooh. Yekka 22 Tipsy Campbell. Have fun with Leo. Congrats on getting in. This is getting too long. Oh my god, my eyes are dying. Thank you very much. Oh, why is... I've never had this problem before. Is this a problem with Elio? Holy sh... What the fuck is going on right now? I think I'm gonna crash. The fuck? It's not my internet. This is not in relation to internet. This is in relation to graphics. I've never had I've never had this hiccup ever before. So I don't know what they just brought out to cause this. Oh my god, what is going on? Oh. Are you kidding me? I Jesus. My eyes are fucking dying. I think it's honestly something going on. There we go. Okay, it's caught up. I think he just went too fast into the city. Get a vest oh, on. Uh, yeah, sorry. My eyes were kind of dying really, really hard there. Sorry. Do you mean an external vest? Yeah, definitely. Okay. Oh my god. They have way too many people here. Alright, let me see policy. Uh, I need the uniform. Give me one sec, guys. Body armor. Is it gonna be that patrol vest? Uh, yeah. That or whatever vest you have. Have with you. Yeah, that's the one you can just change that. Yep. There you mm -hmm. go. See if I can get the right one. Oh, I don't think this is it. This one maybe. Uh, you're gonna have to I see. Think, I think that's too, uh... It's for Kana. Oh, I definitely... So... This one? Yeah, that's fine. That's fine? Okay. That's fine for now. Holy shit! Yes, I need a That summer. might be an SRU vest, but for now I don't care. I'm not too worried about it. I just want you to have a vest on. Okay. We'll get the logistics of what vest you should be carrying with you sorted a little bit later. Right, um, there wasn't anything specifically in the the documents, so we'll have to prepare that. Oh. Right. Are they um, landing in a gonna, helicopter here? Yeah, we're about to put a Blackhawk down. What I'm gonna have you do is as soon as, because I'm gonna have to go up in that Blackhawk, as soon as I'm clear, um, I want you to take my patrol car, get it out of the road, mm -hmm. and, um, 
There's too many units on this scene. If you want to ask That's on the problem. radio where perimeter set up, you can do that and then get to that perimeter and assist wherever they need you. Um, okay. I'd get 201's advice on where you want. All right. I, all right. Yeah, we definitely so, need to get out of here. I was going to say, due to the eye issues, I suspect the perimeter will be far away, hopefully. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, I've never had this texture issue. You realize there's a big ass power line that runs right through the center of your yeah, LZ. Yeah, I, I was sitting here thinking like, why are you putting flares down there? Um, I did not, guys. I did not put any. Uh, look at my Discord announcement about this. So, uh, hello, first night there. I guess so. Where is the actual uh, location of the scene? Uh, Pillbox. Pillbox Medical Center. Pill? Really? What are they doing yeah. with the hospital? Shooting it Very close. Like Hopefully not. Um, Hopefully this is just some sort of target at law enforcement and not civilians. Uh, Alright. I could have sworn I heard that they have shots fired inside. The what is the radio channel? <laughs> that, because they didn't change me. Uh, We're in Metro right now, I believe. We're in Metro. Oh, they did change me. Okay. They actually did change me. Where is that fucking helicopter? There it is. There we go. On. Where was the Believe floor level? That's too many people, level? yeah. I the uh, love it. Love this extra loss. Got We're going to be moving two officers uh, over by the chargers to your left. Is the front door clear here? And can you hold it? Holy shit. Right. I have very limited view range. I can see the uh, vending machines, but I can't see anything to the right. Uh, and I can't see straight down the middle. I can try to move. Oh my god, we actually get to see the Blackhawk the land. Standby. Look at that. You can stay there. We're going to go one at a time. Unfortunately, we have severe texture right. loss. There's just Let's simply go. too many people. Are you two sniper certified? There's still going to be six other hostages inside. I'm going to move this vehicle away. Oh, have we established any type of connection with the hostage shakers? Uh, textures is actually... If anything, you, te uh, you turn them up in terms of storage. I've got it all the way uh, on high, so no. we just have they too many people. Refused. They cut the power line for the, uh, for the phones as well as the cameras. And then we're, we're gonna get out of here. We're shooting. just gonna get out of here. Ten four. One twenty one. Sierra is set. I can see straight down the middle to the double door toward T. It's gonna be cleared this time, I do believe. Two hundred one. Go ahead. Okay, I'm gonna let him leave. Oh my God! Let's just get. Okay, we only have to go down this way. Let me see what's going on here. Do we have that sniper neutralized or off of wherever they were perched? Uh, this is how many units we have on there. Oh my fucking god. Alright, let's go ahead and once uh, we get some clear air, I'm gonna ask where they want me. I don't think we dropped them. I don't know if they have like a, a uh, for a Metro, I don't know if they have like a perimeter scene safety officer or something like that. I, I wanna uh, give it the air for a minute. How many people are by that uh, MRAP, the state MRAP on the other side of... We're gonna go ahead and just move out. For the sake of their graphics, we're gonna, we're gonna move away a little bit. Down officer and one down down down. 40. Just gonna move over here. 10-4, but you've got four active, correct? We got one active... Yeah, we have a ton of people. Patient. We're not going in on it though, guys. We're not trained. We'll make sure that one person uh, we're fucking probably on our own on now. Patients. How many do I have at the lower levels? When it's seen, you have three TAC units, several mobile LSPD, BCSOWs. I need a number. 16 break. I'm afraid to Black like... Taking fire. Oh. We're gonna widen our orbit. Blackhawk is taking fire? 14 approximately five normal officers and deputies. I literally can't... I I'm too afraid to do radio traffic because I feel like I'm gonna interrupt them. Um... You know what, we'll probably Black stay here, Warriors, we'll probably stay from. here and see if anybody starts running. Negative, they shot right for our I don't know right if I'm allowed to like pursue anybody without a, a person or if I should just stay here. How many are on board? If I find them like running past me. Rampage! Colton, let's go ahead and get off the road here. Colton, thank you very much for the five gifted subs. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you so, so much. We've raised altitude high enough. We're not taking shots anymore. I'll advise it any further. Rampage! 
go ahead. I know he told me to go to the perimeter. I don't know where it is, so so I gotta ask. And right now there's priority traffic. Instead of on ground level, or would you like me to remain ground level watching the door? Maintain ground level. Top priority right now is going to be extract of any downed officers and uh, hostages that are out of the building. We're going to get them extract to bind with PD. If you've got one, try to get them extracted. Do not drive in front of it. Take uh, side roads, please. Keep them safe. Get them up there and then return. I want them to do this in an orderly fashion. I want the people over by the MRAP. I need you all to be the first one to do this. After you all, once you get back, we'll move the guys on my side. After that, if there's anybody down at the lower level, we'll move them and then we'll kind of regroup and figure out what we're going to do. Who's my highest ranking down at the lower level? Two and four, is anyone higher ranking than me? Negative two and four, your highest. Two and four, I want you to take Canine control Lass of that is element. transported, uh oh. Sure set up security. Yeah, I'm gonna Before go find. I'm. You're level. right. I should probably we'll see if I can find someone door, doing promoter. Door. Let's go ahead and see if we can find the promoter. Try There's just too, this radio. Uh, too many people around here. Um, over by the MRAP, who's my highest ranking? There's pillbox over there. 98, you've got control of that element. And 05, right. you're Promoter's gonna have control there, of this element right here on our side. Oh my god, it's it's too much. No, it's too much. Now we're leaving. There are too many units. 121 break. I got one being held at gunpoint. It's gonna be right in front of the ward D doors to the left. They're gonna be behind a half wall segment. Oh, the unit map. That is a good fucking. Hey, you just stepped back behind the wall. I, have no I totally idea. forgot we can do this. It's gonna be a gunman holding a nurse. Uh, at gunpoint. Oh my god, this is fucking sick! Stanford. Go Stanford. I cannot get close. What's uh, my firing guidelines? Uh, do not engage. A firm. Everybody else is, um. 398, what's the status to your crew over there? Advise, we've just reached DPD. And for who's still at the MRAP over there? I'm right here. McMillan's right you're here. Three SRG units, sir. They don't really have Simple, much your position. here. I think it'll be fine. 221 to 201. Where do you want me for promoter? 10 9. 221. Where do you want me for perimeter? Uh, try to head to the lower level. I don't know. Uh, 314 or 214 will get with, uh, with you on your assignment. 10 4, I am having eye issues. 10 4. I don't know if I can get that close, man. I can try. I can certainly try. Alright, lower level. Let's get to the lower level. Oh my god. There's too many people. Okay, um, best way to get to lower level is probably gonna be... Yeah, I'm not going that way, fuck that. I need to go around, I need to get... 214, 21. Go for How do I get down, down to the down fucking lower level? Uh, lower level? I'm gonna go down this way. Down I'm just gonna go on the highway, it's gonna be the safest way for me. So, <laughs> I'm on my own already, like, my guy just left me, I'm like, God, that's cool, man. Let's get to the lower level. I'm gonna go around the safe way in terms of my eyesight. I don't know if I can get to the lower level safely. Working to one, I can't confirm no one's down on uh, that lower pillbox. So I've also seen no movement in the lobby. Alright. 10-4. How many people would you I like the down sirens, down? not gonna lie. There's going to be three attack team members and approximately four to five officers and deputies. Okay. Alright, we're gonna slow down here. Two of the tag team members up to the top. I'm gonna need them on the uh, Elgin and Interstate 2 side. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Yep, that's gonna hurt. 217, 201. You and myself know attack. Slow down, slow down, slow down. We can There's no way, dude. There's no way I can do <laughs> uh, Good luck. 
gonna be too risky right now. Holy orbiting, shit! Uh, There's no way. If we want to just fast if we all down onto the road, I'd be okay with that. There's no fucking way I can get nearby this scene. I don't know why. There's way Stand too many units at the scene, the, in my opinion. Uh, pilot two two. Eighty one break. I have a male down here in a tuxedo telling me he's in contact with one of, with one of the hostages. Let's just look on the ground. We we'll just go Simple slow. Maybe 20. we can get. <laughs> no, there's no way, dude. I I can. Said there's seven hostages in the main ICU room. And four armed. If I can just get onto the scene and get out of the car, I think I'll be good. Okay, and you're in contact with them. Just look at the ground. Just Paper. look at the ground. This is okay, guys. So for what is your current twenty? I think we can Eight, get this. Zero four two. So for are you lower? Can't see shit. Paper. Okay. All right. Yeah, all right. 14, 14, Trying to get as much information on this as possible, please. Hey, for Hill and Brand, if I can get you back over here covering the door, I'm gonna head over there. Hey, for the room. One hundred eight, two hundred one. Go ahead. Well, you know, sir, we are hearing the fire alarms going off now inside the hospital. I'm just gonna go to the other side. See if I can get to the other side. Ten four. Break, break, break. That's where everybody is. Dispatch to scene command, be advised. We have a hostage taken currently on that one called testing negotiator. I could not get around. Need somebody for negotiations. Oh my god, this is insane. So are you able to text them back? Where do you want me? I'm left on my own as a probe. Yeah. Wanna... Um, I'm gonna need you to stand. This is. Uh, can't see where all my units yeah, are. yeah. I'm gonna say that the uh, my glasses oh, appear very dirty. Sorry, I can see relatively right. okay, but if Behind my presence that. here is mm -hmm. find which. Before you've got control of that element. Behind the 2020 Explorer, hold okay. um, cover on the front door. Watch for Pretty anyone else walking up into the scene. Front door lower. Okay, I gotta go. Yep. I gotta go. I gotta go. Only go. four to five oh. officers covering it. Step four is that exit block. Uh, I affirm the vehicles that are currently I didn't do it. Blocked, unsure. I can't even we see it. We vehicles inside the garages themselves. We, we could get a unit to block that <laughs> uh, driveway heading out. Alright, we're just gonna keep an eye on the front door, quote unquote, and that's, uh, that's... <laughs> Two four, you can even see the people through. You see that? You can actually That'd see the through them. Option. <laughs> Sorry about your... <laughs> you... Whoops. 121, I got movement at Ward D. Yeah, we can't see out. shit. There's just, the uh, too many people. Back. That's alright. Thank you for the danger zone there. We'll just keep an eye out. Front door. Keep an eye out for anyone suspicious. I one from two. Go ahead, sir. Let's stay like this. My clear to break. I'm gonna set this down. Control Probably should have taken the, my key. rifle out, honestly. And, uh, try and figure out where shit was coming from. But, point of contact. Uh, yeah, I have X-ray vision. Uh, definitely an interesting day. I can't really do much right now, but. Um, so can I, can I don't think I'm gonna need to shoot now. anybody, honestly. I don't have anything so far. I'm not gonna point my weapon just because there's people there in front of me. Kevin, do you see every, anyone else around here? Is it just me? I, and uh, it's me and you. I see a few, few people around that building over there in a uh, vehicle there. I don't know what kind of vehicle it is. MRAP, I think. Um, otherwise, I didn't see anybody where I parked. There were just two state patrols uh, blocking off traffic. No one else around us. Alright, that's yeah, fine. Just, like mm -hmm. I said, ahead, stay over here, watch the overall perimeter, yeah, watch mm -hmm. that guy right there, make sure he doesn't come in any closer, or if he does, okay, he's gonna come to you and ask you for thing. questions. If he says okay. he'd get a text back or anything like that, let me know. Okay, and what happens if he tries to run? Yell over radio that he's running in. Okay. He can run away all he wants, he doesn't have to Oh, he can run away all he wants? Okay, that's it, that's, okay. Yep. If he runs towards you guys, then, alright, let yeah. you know. If he's running in, that's a problem. And then who's this? Sorry, I'm doing all the names. Gray. Just to advise, you did walk out. Uh, Lieutenant Gray? Okay. Yes. Pleasure to meet you. Alright, I'll keep an eye on him. Alright, thank you. <laughs> oh, she looks weird walking like this with her gun out. I couldn't actually tell, but do you have your vest on? Uh, I was given this vest, yes. I have a vest on. Um, it's okay. not the right one, but he's at this point, uh, 
Lieutenant Valentino just said he wanted Vessel on me no matter what, which one it was, so... Yep, that's we didn't fine. have as much as time. Yes, yeah, so you're, you're fine. Alright, one, nine, two, three, I don't, I'm not gonna grab my rifle because I don't need it, one, in my two. opinion. I think there's enough coverage okay, here. I need Alpha team. We'll be Bravo. Uh, team on lower pillbox. We'll keep an eye on him. To us, Charlie. Okay, Watch him try to fucking... That cough sounds fake? Bruh! Did you say my cough sounds fake? All attack teams, just stand by. We're waiting on negotiations here. That's kind of. <laughs> two twenty one is my badge number, and no, I did not join the sheriff's department just for two twenty one. It was just sure it just happened to work that way. Specs, just so you are aware, <laughs> I do have a fifth couple of lodged in the back end. Of this is really neat. This live map. Just be fine at the moment. How I would just be advised there is a fifth cal in play. I'm gonna go ahead and talk to this gentleman here. <laughs> All right, let me see. Sir, what is your name? I'm sorry. Victor. All right, I I understand you're in contact with people inside. I was. You were. Okay. All right. Uh, the lieutenant that was talking to you, he did say, "Come to me if you have any other text from uh, from within." Uh, I do have my weapon in hand. Let me see if I can. Let me, let me see if I can pull out a a big. What about now? No, sir. No, ma'am. So you should take the elevator down from this building and try to oh, find another rooftop to perch on. I don't have anything that's in this. Well, I'll be behind that FPIU if you need to talk with me. Just yell out and I'll uh, come on over. Come out the word A door. He has to move back. Uh oh, I'm sorry. What'd you say? My message went unread. What did he say? Okay. Alright, I'll be. He didn't say anything. He came out with, with like. I cannot hear uh, this guy. You might need to speak up, the by the way. I can barely hear you. And went back to the word eight door. Contact inside is going to be Delta O. Ten four. All right. All right. Again, I'll be behind that vehicle. If you need me, you can just yeah, shout out to me, and I'll come on over. Sounds good, ma'am. Uh, of course, don't don't move towards the building at all. Yes, ma'am. There we go. Oh, my gun does need a flashlight. I forgot to set that up. You know what, there's a few things I gotta set up. Corner of integrity <laughs> Might as well do it now. Involved. Unoccupied this time. Um. There's the black gauntlet. Black Hummer. All black windows. I think it was a flashlight. I just think it's a flashlight for... Another one. For this one. Give me the air. Uh, might have some hostages coming out. Uh, Alpha team, <laughs> get them over towards I see... Y okay, I see a gun in hand right here. Or, sorry. There's... Let's get him over <laughs> towards Bravo. Team. Oh my god, that's terrifying! Uh. Mm -hmm. Who's this? Hello? I am uh, not. Captain Roselli. Team, Captain Roselli, I do not actually physically see you. I just see the gun back. in your hand, but. Uh, they uh, should lovely, be yeah, I'm having the same problems. They don't, I, I, it seems to be the case. Um, I've just around. been keeping an eye on. Oh, yep, go ahead. That's yeah. fucking creepy. Alpha Team copies. So, not able. I've got an individual with a uh, firearm 7195 activation in Elgin. <laughs> Seven nine one five. The hell? Why are they? There's three moving. There's three moving, running. Where are they going? Oh my god, this is so weird. This is so scuffed. <laughs> I'm dude. I'm dying here. The FPS is just absolute shit. You can't really do much about it, unfortunately. 25. I'll have one in custody. If you can uh, get medical over here, he looks like he's been shot. Try to take him up to that uh, staging point if you could. I believe it's up at uh, Vinewood PD. Okay, ambulance is coming in. Oh, there they are. They're on the highway. Yeah, this is this is scoffed. Thank you for the small little raid there. I wonder if there's a way I can fix this. Let me see here. Hold on, guys. Three five, we got a hostage coming out. Man, yeah, my extended budget is pretty fucking high, guys. Coming out. Uh, there's gonna be a gunman behind. Oh, but send them this way. Oh, but send there them we go. Way. I extended a little more. Hey. Hello. You see me now. I'm sorry. Are you about to see me now? I, yes, I see you now. I fixed my personal glasses just a little bit. Is it Kavanaugh? Yes. Gotcha. 
and this was What's going Captain on? Rosselli. Yes, ma'am. I Rusty. I don't know. I was just put on on my own. Uh, Lieutenant Valentino went, went up in the Blackhawk, and he just told me to try to get my way down here and get into a perimeter check. Gosh, are you running with Valentino? Right? Valentino, yes, Lieutenant Valentino. Cool. I just got on shift and no one was in the sheriff radio, so I figured something's going on. Everyone's in Metro. Yeah, they needed additionals here, so we um, we went over here. I wasn't so sure if I could pull out the carbine, so I just decided to stick with yeah, the pistol right mean, now. You're fine. I know. To do that I know. If you need to. Right. Uh, it's. I'm gonna make sure I keep to the rules. So until I know what I can, can and cannot do. Yeah, I mean, usually, have a yeah, any situation like this, clothing, automatically approved. Automatically approved. Right. Yeah. 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 Well, my the vehicle that we're in is all the way under the bridge. I don't think I want to take the uh, uh, opportunity yeah, to run all the way back there again. Yeah. I got you. If anything happens back here, we're basically holding this side. If any hostages come mm -hmm. out, we gotta secure them, and we're just secure. I'm assuming holding perimeter. Okay. 27 County. I've got one of those males with a white mask on. He was just shot. Guys, my thing, my gun has what a light now. Don't worry. That that gentleman is in relation to uh, he lobby. had a, a I guess an insider that he was chatting with via text for a little while, people. but now they stopped responding. Oh, I think he uh, was texting road, a Delta O'Reilly is what what the name was given to me. Interesting. But then the texting stopped. He's allowed to leave the area. He's just not allowed to approach the building, and that's my job is keeping an eye on that. Gotcha. I'm sorry? It's a little nerve wracked. Someone plain clothes mm -hmm. walked up in the AR. I'm not aware who they are. The whole normal texture thing, guys, has changed so because they added, uh, added GTA added a new thing. I just extended my texture budget a little more and it's fixed. Obviously, my graphics are still. This is an awful situation. That's what we know right now. I'm gonna keep negotiating. We're gonna try to get this peacefully. Do you, do you know, you don't know any situation, I'm just wondering if it was in relation to just civilians there, or why they're, you know, I don't infiltrating know. a hospital of all places? I don't know, but it takes one fucked up person to go into a place for sick people, and dying people are being held and go around, yeah. that's what yeah. I know. Well, people who uh, go after the vulnerable are the shittiest kind of right. people. Mm -hmm. We gotta play nice with them to get <laughs> everyone out safely. Yeah, I got a question for mm -hmm. you. What's going on? So that guy over there, uh, mm -hmm. is the guy that says he's in contact with um with him, but I don't. I'm thinking probably not the best area to put him, uh, especially if there's a sniper. So is there any spot? Wait, that you there's a sniper in in the hospital. No, there's supposedly a sniper on the outside somewhere. Are you fucking serious? All right, I didn't know that. So I was gonna uh, move him somewhere that like maybe like a barricade or something on the side. Could even yeah, we could even put him in the I... back of it if he's got no weapons. We really wanted to. I'll, I'll, um... Ooh, 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 no, no, no. Gray, gray vest, you can just have him go cap. in the bus terminal and he shelter in place. He's got a heavy, uh, heavy uh, weapon in his hand. Assault rifle. Oh my gosh. 305. Team Alpha. Oh, he's just picking him up. I'm sorry? You first right on? It, it, that it is. I was hoping for a bit of a quiet day for my first time, but you know, you know how it goes. Life goes that way. You're getting good experience, so. Negative. I'm getting good experience on how you guys set up a perimeter around here. You advise what kind of vehicle you have back there. Yeah. Advise it's gonna be a black. Although I don't really have plans to join in our on what is this our SRU for county. I'm gonna be honest. I'm more in line. Well, my interest lies in with the investigations. Oh, okay. Sad. Must use a lot of fun. Right, so. Alpha team, if you can go ahead and oh, move yes. your ramp back to the park. I'm pretty good at taking and holding onto information. Stand more. Well, that's definitely a valuable skill for it. Okay, what's the game plan here? These shooters. Thank you, Tyler Gate. Thank you very much. Resubscription, I appreciate that. I'm sorry? I'm sniper Copy. sitting Where somewhere out here. I, I heard it. I heard it. So is that an enemy sniper Lower at this point? It's gonna be on the right I know that we have a sniper up. So very vulnerable because I have no idea where that's at. I probably will go just into SRU eventually, annoyed. guys, but that's not my main so interest. So keep an eye on anywhere there. I just don't think it's it fits my character's personality. Well, really. There's an area in that, but I would have thought they would have seen something on a rooftop or something. But I, I was gonna say yeah, I've been keeping an eye up on the roofs just in case, but no one's been. I I don't think that if there is a sniper, they haven't taken a shot yet, which is good. But that makes mm -hmm. me suspicious that if there is one, maybe they're after a target within the building, and if you start taking that hostage out, maybe they might get sniped. 
Uh, yeah, I agree. The first Probably the smart cookie. Hostage situation at pillbox. I've seen a lot go on here, but not this much. I'm sorry. Never seen a pillbox hostage takeover situation in my mm. year. So. In your year as well. I'm glad I, on my very first day, I got to experience something as tragic as this. Hopefully, <sighs> no one ended up getting killed from this. Yeah, I'll pray for it. Aviation. I'm not gonna do aviation for like her, you actually. Said. Well, There's actually, maybe, tomorrow, maybe aviation, so. maybe aviation. Indeed, but she does wear. In a bus that's oh. gonna be able to fit at least uh, oh, ten Lord. people. If we can get that uh, to the upper level. Probably's big sus. No, she's but perfectly she fine. She hasn't learned her tactics from somewhere else. It's okay, There's guys. By the dash on bus company, I can try to. <laughs> I did not leave any department for those coming in, guys. Four, that'll work if you can get that, please. All right. I gotta grab a bus, apparently, so... Alright. All just, uh, stay where safe did the, here uh, uh, where did the, I uh, don't know if you know man... Harley Cover now, but the Q word is not allowed man, here. Cause uh, stuff like this terminal. will happen. So just keep, the terminal, uh, all right. keep an eye on that. Make, uh, I'll just, I'll just uh, send word over radio if he starts walking towards the building. Gotcha. Alright. Uh, thank you, Coprock, again, for the 3,000 bits. That's you're fucking beautiful today. Um, you I don't know Harley Kevin, but the keyword is not allowed. I'm not gonna say quiet with this character unless it's a just a sure. word. This character is a more serious character, guys. That'd As you that. can see, she's more serious. She's uh, inclined to do her job well because you know she wants to be a part of this department, of course. Um, obviously, she's a pretty smart cookie in some sense. She wants to go into investigations, be a detective. Um, that is where her skills lie, is detective work, where basically information gathering is her Black skill. A uh, huge skill set of hers. Sure. Um, that's what I want to bring with this character, is all of this stuff. Like, just a character that is not after himself or after anybody else. Stop it. I'm it not yawning. Not. Dude, I think it's my medicine, actually. I actually think it's the medicine. I've been taking- this is my second day of steroids. Um... Negative. I and I think it's the actually the steroids out. that are uh, caught because it. yeah, it's supposed to take them in the morning because quote unquote you won't be able to sleep without them or with them. So I bet you it's that that's causing it. I do feel like I can yawn, but yeah, I think it does make me more awake. Sorry for the low FPS, guys. I do plan to reinstall my GTA onto my solid state drive soon. I'm wondering if that might help with a lot of things. Um. But in general, I think everybody is just getting fucked with this scene. There's just so many people. Uh oh, they're getting. What was your last minute? Oh, I see. Try I don't know if you can play smart so character. Fuck You're you, Jackal. How did I become sure if I didn't leave an apartment? Uh, civilian reserve became a thing, and I, I've been wanting to do Elio for quite a while now, probably about a year. I've been wanting to do an Elio character that is not myself. That is not. So just Invincible, aware, we have a and this is that character, and again, I have a huge backstory for her that you guys will learn over time. Uh, uh, went into surgery to get three gunshot wounds, la 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 la, la, la. she's just... Can if they found anything in the vehicle. <sighs> I do feel the urge to yawn, I just don't. Let's get that cap right now, that's up. all. Um, get it kind of in a hidden spot, please. This is kind of fun to watch yeah, from this side, though. Time. I'm learning quite a lot with how, you know, they set up everything. So excited to learn the backstory. Yep, yep, yep. Would I ever do civilian RP? I already do civilian RP. This character will be going off duty, guys. She will be getting making yeah, connections off squad, duty you know, as well. Level if you want to move that LSPD Bearcat. And yeah, she does own a car. I just don't know. I haven't figured out what car I'm gonna get her yet. Get it's gonna be a probably to shitty to car. So. You had two years. Fuck yeah, that's awesome. 14, 2 1. Go for it. So tell me, patrol guys, you got down there. Have at least one or two of them ready and shake. How cars. laggy is it for you guys, anyways? Uh, once you think it's going, we'll need to have people that are going after them. I'm going to get with 305. We're going to get the plan together. For will be, uh, entering the uh, building. We'll we're probably going to give them free passage. Uh, that's probably the only way we're going to get out of this with uh, no hostages harmed. We'll have a team set up a tactical team set up to go ahead and try to take down this We do have a holster in- another team ready to go We do have a holster script. So if I put my gun away, show. it shows up in my holster. When Track I take it out, it is taken out. Can we get a patrol unit to be in their vehicle hidden? Uh, I see whoever's in that F-250 at the back. 
move your vehicle to where it's not blocking the parking lot. Have it hit us. Be ready to chase. 1601. Did he call my name? I hope he didn't call me. I I don't I I don't. I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to do any chases 16-01. with that. Go ahead. I don't think I'm supposed to be part of any pursuits track. without a, a uh, person. There's no way they put me on a pursuit by myself right now. Team, we'll stop anytime during tracking. Tip, we're just tracking that black dog. <laughs> Two six. There's going to be a red and colored transit bus, 28 of 87 David Foxtrot Henry 772. It's going to be our bus. It's going to be en route to the upper level pillbox. If we're standby real quick, guys. Yes, yeah, so right in bus. Oh, six. Make sure that's entered into the AOPR system. Clear the air, please. They actually got a huge bus for all these. I've never seen this. This is actually fucking neat, dude. Where are they? Why are they looking up towards there? They're looking up in the sky for some reason. I'm a probie. I have so no clue what I'm supposed to do if something happens. I know that, that I'm gonna protect someone if I get, or if I'm gonna shoot back if I get shot up in terms of movement. To leave through that way. If I need to move somewhere, if they're telling me to get in the car and pursue, uh, <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm not gonna go into a police vehicle. You know, this isn't even my department. I guess he's going to the upper uh, floor. Control two one. I wonder if I can just. Oh god. If this will help my FPS by bringing up my extended budget all the way up. Blackhawk, what's your ETA? Let's see if it does help a little bit. Just lift it off. I feel like it did a little bit. I guess we'll see. Control 2 1. It's giving you speed vibes, bro. That's a good fucking movie. Go ahead. Yeah, I mean, yeah, obviously I'm a pro view, and I'm gonna shoot to protect back. myself or anybody else. Like, I will do that. I know I can do uh, that. Where are they at right but now? in terms of pursuing without a com uh, supervisor with me, I don't think I can do They'll that. Be all right. They wouldn't buy two FPS. Hey, I'll take it, man. At least we can see. Stand by, <laughs> let me get with the negotiator and figure where they want it. Going back up. Get out of sight if you would. I could definitely see you actually go. Now I can see. I feel like I could see you going into SRU, but I I could so see her dispatch, doing it being TAC men if she does. Because she does, she is supposed to have a little bit of um, medical experience, not you know the extent to the extension maybe. of you know starting an IV maybe, but she definitely knows how to pack a kind of like a, a combat. Um, Medic almost. Yeah, great. That's a good. That's a good joke. Alpha team, get ready. <laughs> oh my God! Black one one of our guys got three. hit. Don't land, but you get my drift. Where's the gentleman, anyways? Let me see if I can Alpha find. Team, get ready. We'll have. Did he leave? Like three coming out. Uh, Bravo team, if you can cover is. them, please. Alpha team will take them. We'll get them in vehicles, get them transported to uh, Vinewood, or sorry, to Mirror Park. 201 are all the hostages and hostage takers leaving or just hostages? Has hardly ever been shot. Negative, just hostages. Um, no. yes. The work, that line, the work that she did prior to being in this apartment, yes. She has been shot probably a few times in her past life. She, you know... You'll find you'll find out more about her as time goes, guys. <laughs> she was not in armed services, no. Two fourteen two one. Go for. Do you have eyes on your uh, northern side? Uh, who is this here? Grant. I'm I sorry. Have eyes on the front. I do have Grant. On the side. Grant, what, what what is your rank there? Okay, I need only one person yeah, designated definitely. on that side just oh, in case they um, jump in a vehicle drive in terms off, of one, one unit call on that. They mentioned that something side, about uh, uh, potentially garage pursuing entrance. them because they're going to let them so go into their own there, vehicle. Uh, I was just left alone. I wasn't given any instruction other than staying here. So I assume I'm staying okay. here even if anything yeah. takes so off. I would just stay here because of where the tech units are going to fall. Right, yeah, the tech units are going to fall. I just want to make sure. Yeah, you're good. 
Yeah, I'll just stay <laughs> here. I'm gonna leave that to the SWAT unit back there and give me for that special yeah. part of the side. <laughs> Is she American? Yes, yes. she was born in America. Do you actually have an extra carbine in your back, or just one? Um, I have- I just have one, but I do have a shotgun. No, that's not gonna help here. I'll just keep my pistol. I, uh, parked my vehicle all the way under the bridge, because that's- I couldn't get through. That's probably the vest I need right there. <laughs> She's not from Ireland, guys. Her grandmother was Irish- grandmother, but, you know. They immigrated to America, and her mother w and her mother was born in America, and then she was born in America. Like she has no ties with her Irish background. The only thing that she has that's remotely Irish is maybe the green eyes a little bit, but that can happen in anybody. Thirty four hostages out the front, head towards Alpha. Three five, we're gonna have a break here now. There's gonna be two more hostages coming out. Holy shit! Ten hostages. Hello? No wonder this is an all call. What is her husband's name? Her husband's name is Keith Kavanaugh. Alpha team, you'll need to designate. Um, in terms of Keith's Irish background, I have no clue. That's, you know, I, I never went down deep into that uh, backstory, so. Because obviously she would have taken on her husband's last name. She just happens to have a Irish background, but Make that's sure not. Yep. So they're gonna be having ten hostages through the lower or upper. I'm not sure what they found. All right. I'm not gonna worry about the vest, guys. It's not really important right now. What is her maiden name? I never actually thought about her maiden name. <laughs> I just realized that. I never even thought about her maiden name back in Red M either. She has some like intense some music here. Coming out. If they do, Bravo will take them to our side and then we'll transport them over to the uh, Mirror Park gas station. Mirror Park gas station, good. Danger zone. Thank you very much for the follow there. Yeah, once we get more comfortable as a deputy, guys, we will start adding music and back one. music into our patrols here. Um, but right now, uh, I need to listen to everything. You're uh, with the Alpha Team, correct? Quinn? No, it's Ten not. Four. Shut up, Jackal. Shut up. Four, can you assume uh, team lead of that team, please? 10-4, I'm helping coordinate over here already. There are 17 people inside. Do you know how many uh, hostages were inside? So far, I've counted 12 based off of radio traffic. Five, Last time I heard it was now. either 7 or 10. Okay. Off the side, have y'all transported those hostages? Jesus. Mm -hmm. 10-4, they're fireworks. good to go now. Yeah. Hey, for him, go ahead and cover. Bravo will be taking in the next two that come out. I haven't had that happen in a while in the server. Oh my... Sixteen. Anybody aware of these explosions we're hearing right now? Forty. I believe that was the U.S. thirteen. Did I want to have an Irish maiden name? Probably. Probably. I'd have a. Hey, for you can disregard this. I would. Uh, no, because then her mother wouldn't. Yep. Just fireworks. Yep. I assume so. I heard about that in the news that there tends to be a lot of fireworks going off in the city. Fireworks a lot. Right. Look how many units are on two, oh my fucking god. One, two, three, four, five. I'm not even gonna count them. There's so many people here. There's probably a good close to 30 people around here. Yeah, this is how many people are in this area. Fucking insane. Really quiet, it makes it really eerie, not gonna lie. Q 
223, are you, do you have a patrol car on scene? Three, three, ten, four. Stand by. You on the latest NVE update? No, I don't pay monthly for the NVE. Um, what I'll probably do is pay every three months and just get it updated every three months. I just can't afford, like, I think it was, I forgot how much it was monthly, like ten bucks monthly. I can't afford that. Or fifteen, I think it was. I just can't afford that, so I'll probably just update it every three months. 1601. Danger zone. Thank you very much for the follow there. Go ahead. Who do we want to put 221 with for the time being? What's your 20? She should be on the yeah. south side of pillbox near 214. Are you trying to speak there, four, Grant? 14, if you can get with her, just hmm? pair her up with somebody. Oh, I keep, I thought I was, you were trying so to speak. Four, four, I have her standing behind a no. CD charger. At so many units attached. I'm going to have 223 probably take her for the time being until we can get her with an FTO. 121, 201, do you want to move from my position on Sierra? Just hold that position just in case anything happens when they come up in North End. Give me to know if she give her a dollar from me? I don't think that's the case. Uh, we are not doing a takedown on the Tilla Disc. The Savior of PS Mark is on shift entry. Air unit will have the air once they uh, come out. Air unit, please call out when they drop. I think I already have use effects. Yeah, I have use effects on. I'm gonna have two people designated to pick up the hostages. That is gonna be your only job. Do not fail that. Great. Like I said, I'm going to reinstall my GTA eventually on my solid state drive. That alone should help, bar. but... And their job is going to be to pick up the hostages and transport them This is just to, a matter uh, of there being 30-plus people in one area. It really... I don't think no matter what there. I do, it's not going to help unless I turn MBE completely off. Not up here. They just need to be in cars ready turn to use go. They're not going to drop these uh, last two hostages. They're taking them with them. We're not going to be able to negotiate that out. Really? Uh, I'm going to just step away for a moment to fix my eyes a bit. Non-tack units on the side. Parking lot to have Turn their cars off. ready. Is that, are they okay, so when I'm looking at it, I get about 20. Do we know? How do I? Just stand by. They're going to drop them off one or two blocks away. The main goal right now is once they get dropped off, air unit's going to call them out. Oh, yeah, it does Wherever give me some FPS. Look at that. I'll have to remember that whenever listen, I get on scene. Oh, thank you very much for that. Yeah, that gave me about 10 more FPS. It does make things look a little meh, but for big scenes like this, perfect. Let us know that you've got the hostage when you get them. Once we have both of them, then we'll worry about the Thank you very out. much for that, we Dev. Uh, five, simple. Figure out what our entry plan is going to be to get into this building as well as who else is going to be chasing. 214, I need two units from that side parking lot to advise. non tac units. 40, I'm located on South 13, directly outside the uh, side parking lot. That's the one we're talking about. 240, 340. That's 240. 240, you got one. 223, I'm gonna have you take the other. 223, go get 221 and be ready in your car. Okay, someone's gonna come pick yep. you up. All right. They're gonna get their own patrol vehicle then. Yeah. Okay. Oh boy, get a minute chase! Yeah. I'm gonna be back here until I'm picked up. How many state vehicles do you guys have over there? We have about four. How many units do you have? Five units. Who am I going with? I'm going with 223. Uh, She's right here. 223, all right. Uh, so why don't you go stand by vehicle? She's right here. Yep, I see her. I see her. Go all right. back over She's going to have to get her car sidewalk. out of the garage because her car okay. is being stupid right now. So. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm sorry. I don't know your name, miss. It's Montana. Give Montana? me a second. What rank is she? She's uh, probably a senior deputy or something. I get 50 uh, FPS if I'm not on a scene with 30 plus people, I'll tell you that. Hang on, I'm having <laughs> severe eye issues real quick. Yep. I'm gonna go ahead and position here until she gets everything fixed. <laughs> Twins? Nah. It's just that this hairstyle works. I like this hairstyle because of the veins. Honestly, it's mainly the Banes. If we could, if I could get her long ponytail, Good braided work. ponytail, I'd fucking use that in a heartbeat. Besides your two uh, hostage pickup units, y'all will be responsible attack units that are with you for clearing. So we might be going into pursuit, which will be very um, interesting. Alpha team, you will be responsible for chasing. <laughs> Just understand when they come out, do not get right up behind them. Let them go. 
hang out once the hostages are Montana gone. and this character could be friends with it? Could be. I don't, don't know. It depends on the personality. Okay, there she is. Uh, Bravo team is going to end up clearing the building in the top floor. Charlie team will clear the bottom floor. And then the two hostage uh, rescue guys on Charlie team, I need you to identify. 223 and 240. All right, so we might be in a pursuit here. Woo, what? Two, it's going to get exciting. 223 up at the top level or at the bottom level? Negative. I just need them So you're going to be in pursuit they if they uh, run? I believe so. Okay. So Do you have... Uh, uh, are you going to be using your carbine? Because my carbine's in the, the my vehicle the of Lieutenant Valentino's. They will move in once the yeah, I'm going to be using the, the carbine. The okay, I'm going to keep the pistol then. Unless you have an extra in the back. I might. You might have to look. 10-4, 240 and 223, did you copy that? 40, clear. Uh, 1-2-5-2-1, Alpha Stack, we have a... My eyes are messing up so bad right now. Are you sure you're able to pursue? Do you think you'll be able to? I think I'll... have to switch. Uh, uh, yes, I think I can keep up, for sure. Okay, yeah, my am eyes are messing to, up. Am I allowed to, though? One sec. I'll certainly... 14 to 1. Make sure that Tahoe's plate is entered in AOPR, please. <coughs> oh, man. Through 5 to 398. <coughs> okay. You want, me to move, you want me to tell him to move it back here? Okay. Okay. Oh, don't run into the stoplight. 227 to 14 to vote. Three or five metro. Good. There's a chance you can get three ninety. There's no vehicles in front of you. Clear for a little while. Stand by, stand by. Make sure seconds. I'll check. Stand by. I got him on the phone. Disregard. Yep. Hey, I'm disregard. Twenty-seven to two fourteen direct. You're so clear. Go for it. Three yeah, I'm, we're gonna sit up here. The Bearcat back okay. to zero four two. I don't think it's, I'm going to be driving. I shouldn't be anyways, but Good yeah, course. if I issues cause an issue, then I don't know. I'm perfectly fine now. Once the scene is over, I'll turn my effects back on. <laughs> this is an intense fucking scene for my first day. Okay, we're gonna have a scene when I, I will t tell you that. 1601. You might want to pull up a little so this gentleman. Oh, no, no, no. He's, yeah, he's gonna. I guess he's gonna be oh, in front. Okay. Mm -hmm. 16 is priority. Just assuming you guys are the other chase vehicle? Yeah. I guess so, yes. Okay, cool. So I'll just hang out here with you guys <laughs> until we get a word. Yeah, I'm 23 to 1. There, so I'm just gonna hide over here. Uh, are you guys gonna be able to pursue with your eye issues? I'm good now. So You're good now. Right now, right. One yeah, now that I've moved away from the direction. I, I, I know that. I know that if you can the afford to uh, that, you will kind of extend your, um, okay. you know, your your um, eyesight, that helps out a lot. Personally, for me, anyways. Blackhawk will be following the bus that will have another hostage. Follow the Blackhawks' uh, call out. <laughs> All right, looks like we're not going to be Copy, in, uh, call, driving, call. but we potentially might have to shoot someone, which, come on, this is not what I wanted my first day. I really was hoping for a quiet day, but that is what I get for... Go what the fuck kind of car... What is that kind of car there? 16 for 01. We might need to keep an eye on that car Go there. Ahead. We've touched the Blackhawk down temporarily. We're just wasting fuel right now. As soon as that bus goes to pull away, let us know and we'll spool back up. 10-4. That vehicle there is not... The six mid the bus up here. Once you do, come group up on Alpha Team, please. Yeah, from the one in the roundabout. I don't know if it'll be possible to park it there. If you're able to do that, and I'm at the Bravo on him. Team. Sorry. I'm not sure. One twenty one two one. Go ahead. You want to try to get this DOT unit on out of here, just so he's not in crossfire. 
Yeah. I'm gonna call it a radio, yeah. Like play the Black Tahoe at the I'm just keeping an eye on him. LPR. If he gets out of his car, I'm definitely gonna call it. <laughs> There's no way he can do anything there, is the thing. Let me see here. Control 2 1. Hold the air. We've got five hot or uh, five suspects. I'm just keeping an eye on him. Bus now. They've got one hostage with them. Blackhawks pull up. We're up. Blackhawk. They're gonna be. They're gonna be northbound on Elgin. Northbound on Elgin. As soon as he steps out of his vehicle, that's when. Oh, without Jesus. Quick, I distracted you. Run wired, looking <laughs> car. Run. Oh my God, Black Cop Rock. Why would you do that? Thank you very much it? for the 3,000 bits. Oh my god. Are they leaving now? Two and four, I just saw two units followed if they can advise. Alright, I guess we're in the chase. Two, three. Two and four, y'all stay on it, Blackhawk. You got the air. I would still- I know the air is holding, but if there's someone that gets out of the car with a fucking gun, I'm gonna call that shit over radio. It doesn't matter. Blackhawk, stand by. Alright, well, it looks like we might be at least taking our gun out today. We'll see. Yeah, if someone right, comes we're up to Northbound Meteor, it's gonna be postal seven two eight two. <laughs> Still Northbound Meteor, gonna be making a left turn now into Vinewood. We're gonna be westbound Vinewood. Danger zone. By uh, thank you very much for the danger zone there. Appreciate that. Right in front of the casino. Oh boy. Hey, uh, he's getting spooked right now. So yeah, we're still west on Vinewood, crossing Lost Laguna. We're back, we're right? on Eclipse yeah. now. All right. What's up? Uh. Westbound Eclipse. What did he want? Follow a, a distance behind. Bias. Okay. You know they call it a break of a radio to the rank? Uh, if there's somebody, if there's a, a, a suspicious vehicle and they go out with guns to try to help out their people in Bill Box, I'm gonna fucking do break. I don't fucking care what rank I am. If they're about to get ambushed by yeah, people because they're focused on the front door, yeah, I'm gonna call that out. <laughs> Alright, this is things are getting a little choppy here because we are moving, but hopefully. Cross the Mad Wing Thunder. Yeah, the effects off definitely makes things look a little meh, but... Status. They're running on foot up here. 381, it's status on top. Why is she not following? Hey, uh, can y'all take care of her, please? She's just in my car right now, okay? Yeah, I'll, who's, I'll get her who's, out. What's going on? We're grabbing one of the hostages. Okay. Come on, ma'am, get in the car. Just take care of her, please. Okay. Break, break, break. They're gonna be dropping the hostage right now. Seven zero three five at the cemetery parking lot. What's the? I think the over. fire is stationed at the uh, Mirror Park station, uh, gas station. Two forty, get on it. Check it in GPS, please. Forty, I'm in around. Ninety eight. Any other? Anyone have eyes on the the black tile? If you turn around here, just go straight. Three twelve. They dropped the hostage <laughs> from the black tile. Oh, we did. What's the reason this is SAF? For a couple of SO hey, ma'am. How are you doing yeah. right now? 16, someone get on that black banshee that just took off. Ma'am? Uh, yeah. Alright, were you shot, hurt, anyway? Anything like that? Somebody from this bus no. just stole a black banshee. No, alright. We're getting you over to uh, medics to help you out, alright? Still gonna be on this bus. Westbound, Just Westbound. focus on your breathing, alright? You are safe with us One, now. Two, I have it. He's going westbound marathon. Okay. Left on South What's State your name? City Ave. You just 1050. Carver, let's get another unit with him if we have it. Ma'am, what's your name? Bus is gonna be now. Del Perro Freeway, pulling into the parking lot right by the beach. Yeah, it's can you say that again? Sorry, get, yeah. Uh, what yeah, is your name? He's gonna be running for another vehicle. Let's Arias, see units with it. Two males running for another vehicle. It's gonna be a gray in color. Already. Four door. Two right, vehicles, I don't know if I moved. I just remember them 
Uh, gas station, gas station. 25, the bus is empty. Yeah, they're still there, okay. Well, you guys can go ahead and converge. 16, I'm gonna start. All right, man. All right, I'm muting that alert. I'm sorry, I gotta get, I gotta focus on this cop rock. I'm so sorry. Like, I am an RP right here. Yeah, we have the yeah, we go. hostage. All right, ma'am, why don't you go ahead and let's go over here. Paramedics, check you out. What was your full name once more? Arya Stanton. You have no. All right. What was it? Arya Stanton? Her name is uh, Arya Stanton, right? Did you say? Yeah. I'm I'm right. Okay. Where's you that guys know her? At? Yeah. Yes. All, All right. right. You can come with us. Um, Alright, can you want me to learn any more? Uh, there were some hostages being dropped off during the middle of, uh, them leaving. Yeah, I'm sure they'll be brought over here. Um, Coprock, thank you again for the 3,000 bits, sir. Sorry I had to mute it. I am an RP, so I want to focus on that, too, when I'm an active RP like that. two have been dropped off and taken. I do believe they have more. I do really want to focus on that, but... Um, I do appreciate it a lot. Thank you very much for being so generous today. We got a box. Alright, let's get some units with that. Where's the other Savannah? All right. Well, I appreciate okay. it. Uh, take care of her. We will. Thank you. Are we gonna go back, or are we gonna One stay here to take any sort of statement? One second. I'm. They're still in the middle of pursuit. I can't really. So I'm gonna join your pursuit. I'm above you. <laughs> Does anyone have eyes on the third vehicle that went south in Del Perro? K9 has on suspect for pursuit. Two one. Are we clear to clear the bottom floor? 10-4 when that Tahoe left. Man, they're, they're cleared now. I got the sedan south on North Rockford Drive. They're gonna be east. Alright, um, I don't know if we're supposed to take a- I feel like we're supposed to take a statement here, um... We got a lock. Aria... Bucci, gonna be crossing over Peaceful Street, crossing over Alto Street. Crossing over Power Street. I believe they're all in pursuit, so... On Vespucci, crossing over Elgin. And clearing. I'm not sure if we're still needed for perimeter or not, though. I'm gonna head back that way. Crossing over Strawberry. Alright, I've got an Aria Stanton here. She's gonna be 17 minor. Uh, her father is gonna be Tyler Thank Stanton, who Strawberry. is... A state trooper, I think it says here. Oh, an update on our pursuit. We're headed northbound. Uh, adoptive 15, father here. Um, she does have some... Okay. I was gonna say she has a mild case of anxiety, and then like, wait a minute, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not fucking a firefighter, so it doesn't matter. That information does not Yo, matter. I'm going back on. Go under. Go under. Go under. <laughs> do the firefighters know you joined B C S D? Yes, I do. Of course, I do. This is a different character though, so negative that's how I'm gonna do that under. out. I don't see him up top either. We might still get into this pursuit. We don't know yet. 16 primary unit on that silver. If you want to thank you very it, much for the follow there. Clear. Sixteen, we're gonna break for that other pursuit. Oh, yeah, yes. we're gonna head to that pursuit then. Okay. All right, might have a little bit, yeah, plate. eye issues here for just a sec. A firm. Is it in the system? I think I'm having well, those eye issues because she now. is as well. What's well, the vehicle description on that vehicle on the 15? It's gonna be a black banshee. We last saw it at the Substantia exit. They went opposite lanes, went through area. Oh, I see. She put her own thing there. Silver two doors in custody. Are the sirens public? I don't know. They're Keen sirens. Keen is the one who made them. I'm pretty sure they're not public, but... Um... Thank you very much for the follow. In terms of LEO, I've wanted to try LEO for a while, guys. I have mentioned it before, but I've wanted to try it with a character that is... Uh, more in-depth, more... Uh, oh, more unique to her backstory, up. and that's gonna create some pretty interesting stuff. Last postal would have been 9392. Oh, you're gonna want to go to the right up here? According to the GPS? I'm gonna check, uh, the Stanchia road. Trying to help her out here, because I don't think she knows the uh, roads very much. But my character technically has lived here for a few years on her own. Back in, like, when she was 21, 22, she has lived in the city of San Andreas. That's why she knows the area very well. <laughs> oh, when I got it, I think. 
Yep, it's gonna be in front of me. We're headed northbound on the 15. All right. Mile marker. We're gonna be coming up on that gas station. <laughs> 102, I'm behind you. I'll call it continuing northbound, Route 15. There's no course the gas station. One can 15, I'm up to 13 split for spike. There we go, we got our uh, FPS back up a bit. Good? Or just keep up call out. It'll be at the 1315 split. Zach went very fast, so I don't think she's trying to. I don't know if she's trying to catch up to the pursuit or not because. Or you'll be good to set them. I'll let you know when we're getting up there. We're going I might need to change the sirens for the. Okay, there we go. Coming up on green now. Stand by. Alright, green is uh, we're right here. One lane, now we're right two. behind him. Just safe behind. Uh, yeah, if, if uh, they're right in front of us by about I think forty seconds, by All the right. sounds of it over the radio, maybe number thirty. Number two lane. Number two lane. We're coming up on you now, passing Charlie. Coming up on the split. Number two lane. Number two lane. We got a unit ahead of us. Right, I hear him. Spikes up. Spikes up. Ten four. Everybody give us a tax I hope with uh, four operators inside the primary. 10 4, take that vehicle. Two bail, one with gun, one with gun. Oh my god. Oh my god, she's having a lot of trouble right now. Over the helicopter to the right. Brain issues. Where's the second one? Where's the second one? Right down the middle track. Right the to the right. Track. Northbound. Do you have a gun in hand? Not in hand. Am I chasing? Yep, we're gonna get out and they chase. Have, yeah, they have one on uh, gunpoint. Goes for a car. Say bye. If he takes the car, take him. Alright, they have one there. He's on a radio right now. Oh, uh, they have one there? Oh god. You're right for that public street as well. Same. Alright. I think one is still on foot, but they are chasing it on car. It's too far away for foot. Okay. Still running down towards uh, <laughs> Norway. Here, we got a taser on his left. Go ahead and try to push him left. Uh, are they up the hill? Yeah, they're up the hill. Oh, shit. They're up the hill. I'm just going to follow her. Any closer to that tree, I'm going to take him. Get medical started. All right. Taser okay, successful. I'm gonna get a med bag. I'm in custody. I'm gonna get my gun out, actually. How many is that in custody now? Three, I believe. Oh, we'll, we'll do some med. Oh, they've got a med bag. Oh, one a sec. Oh, you have a med bag? We uh, had shots fired and took a suspect down in the city. So I believe we three, unless there's any other You guys have it? Alright. 125, y'all took one in, correct? Uh, they've got med bag with, with them. I think they're tech, tech meds. Okay. You had one occupant in it, correct? <laughs> if y'all need no, more no, gauzes, no, no, no. we both yeah, have Yeah, everyone, I need all hands, hands over here. Let's okay. go grab gauzes. I've already grabbed the med bag. Dave, I'm just comparing 25 with those, okay. uh, liquor shop. He's right here in front of you, for you guys? Negative, there was one at the liquor shop, and then we had one at lower Yeah, he may have to kind of come back and... Yeah, I might need to relay down. There we go. One away. We have one here at eight zero nine two. All right. She is uh, again. She is experienced in a bit of medical arp med. Ten four. I think we got five. Got them all. Two thirty. Can we get a uh, tech med over <laughs> to three zero five seven? It's a little. Uh, that's a little Good wonky right now. One eighteen two fourteen. Let me know if you need me over there with you. This is just for my firefighter stuff. I, I know what to ask, so, but I'm not gonna overdo it. <laughs> we should probably get this vest off of him. Now, sir. He's got 17 GSWs. Yeah, let's get this vest off carefully as much as we can, just to get them packed perfectly. I'll go ahead and cut it off of him. Hooray! You? Yep. Take his hoodie off as well. Hooray, is that that's you? a hoodie. It's a helmet. You are. Very dark. Uh, well, was he uh, 
Run over by hey. vehicle. 17 GSW is to the chest. Oh, right, holy right. shit. Get the vest off. Hey, yeah, you got no ID on him or anything. There get the go. shirt, get the pants, get everything off of him. Yep. You've got that suspect with, who's got the suspect with the gray sedan from 125? 17 gunshot wounds. He's, he's, he, I bet he's gonna promote. Check for a pulse. Do you have a pulse? Pulse was very low. Uh, who's got the okay. one that, uh, 206 called within the How low? General? I don't know. Mm, I'll just do he's that. He's dropping. He's dropping. Does he have a pulse? 230, blue over here. Okay, I guess he doesn't. Go ahead. Um, someone not attack med. Go ahead and start CPR. Anyone who knows how to do it, just go. I'll go for it. Okay. Actually, Kavanaugh, do you know how to, how to use a BVM? I do, yes. Okay, actually, wait, no, never mind, that's Montana over there. Yeah, you do, you do, uh, chest compressions. You want me to Montana? Just go? Yeah. You do BVM. I have the Tahoe and CPR. I'm gonna start IV. Yeah, who is following the Tahoe? Y'all lost someone. <laughs> go and continue wound packing and whatnot, so Brand. Just get gauze put over everything, I don't care. I've, I packed one wound, uh, gunshot wound, but that's one of very many. Yeah, there's, there's so many all over his chest, just start throwing gauze on top of it, Hillenbrand. <laughs> Yep, I got you. So yeah, for her, for Harley Kavanaugh, I do have it that she is medically experienced to some extent. Um, that's why I'm thinking medical attack med would actually be really good for her. Did you get an airway Okay. We have not checked the airway. Okay. You two tune into it. If something happens, you are responsible to tell me. Okay. Well, this is an exciting first day as a uh, first ride along, patrol ride along. I, I haven't even been with Valentina for the last like hour and a half, it seems like. Can someone keep an eye on his pulse, see if he get, we get it back so I can stop? Hey, Alright, Gray, uh, Connie has life packs, right? This yeah. is a different character, yeah, guys. She's packs. more serious. If, as you can notice, I'm using Transform a different tone of voice for her. Anything. Have you checked to see if there's any blood in his airway before you, you start the BVM? The no, I just threw it on there. Go and remove the BVM, Montana. Hillebrand, check his airway. If not, I have a suction device if you don't. Yeah, they always. Uh, I think that's pretty I no, standard to check. I have asystole. Airway. We can't <laughs> shock. Uh, do you guys yeah, we're still working on CCTV in the area. Yeah, I was just about to start a second line. Yeah, it's almost three hours stream, dude. It's because we got into that uh, thing. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna leave in the middle of it, especially for my first day. This is great. For uh, just advising, since the air was uh, held, seems that the uh, suspect that was in the gray coupe. Yeah, Harley can show off a little bit of her uh, med skills. Of let me know if my uh, CPR is pumping out blood further from this throat. I've got two people already on that frequency. That's all I need on it. If something happens, we'll let it's me fine. Know. I have ringers pushed as well as mm -hmm. DW. That's okay. gonna help increase the blood promotion. Just keep. We need his heart beating. So just keep yep. doing CPR. You're going. doing just fine. Three ninety three eighty one. I have eyes on the vehicle. Doing just fine. On the street. Um. Alright, airway's clear, go ahead and BVM. Put an OPA in there first. Okay. Oh man! Just cause he's crashing. This is good stuff, dude! I love this side of things. I love being- I love focusing on doing more, like... Character. That gun's been cleared, right? He, all his weapons have been cleared? Like, these small details of Do we have how EMS she's acting. In? Do they I, I love working on that. that. Wait, is this suspect clear 3057 that we're treating? Air, uh, uh, Air Med might be deployed from this, maybe. Uh, it is on the highway, though. It is close to pillbox on the highway. I don't know if they'll need it. Um, just... Honestly, he's probably going to be a DOA, anyways. 115, do we also have medics in route for 3057? Switches online for Bailey's phone number. Hello, Delta? Get the fuck away from Bailey. Uh, unknown. No, we don't. Go and call medics. Please. County 201, if we can get medics in route to 3057, we'll need them adjacent to mile market delta as well as the uh, trailer park. You should just call the freeway. I don't know how they're going to get up here. 7 4 11. One for medical PT is going to be code blue for approximately five mics. Double GSW's blood had air. What was in its airway has now been. It's pillbox right, even open right now. Good point. Good point. That we'll need Crashing him. 17 GSW center mass. We just threw gauze over top of it. Everything we uh, can. They're sucking. It yes. doesn't matter. At this point, it doesn't fucking matter. We just need to get the, some of the blood stopped. I, have I, don't have, I don't have time to check for sucking GSWs. Okay. 
uh, chest rising and falling equally? Chest isn't rising and falling at all. He's not breathing. Oh, so, well, that's fucking breathing. Right now. Okay. Since if you are right now, blood, blood in his throat, airways okay, continuing. You got, a, you got a BVM. Yeah, Should we have her on BVM. He's right. been he's been given an OPA. We push 0.1 of FE. He has asystolic, asystolic rhythm. We push okay. Ringer Solution DW as our medline. So if you want to go and push a second 0.1 of FE for me in the medline of DW on the right arm. Montana, can we switch our right, jobs here? I've been in for about a minute and a half here. Go yeah, y'all going Make to sure I don't out. get too tired. Alright, you ready to Direct switch in three, two, one. There you go. Alright, good job. Correct. Good job. Alright, you want me to establish another yeah. medline in the right arm, Gray? No, we only need one medline. I, I want to try to make sure that people right um, focus. Because when you're doing solution. CPR, if you have a secondary person, you really should switch every uh, so one to, to two minutes so you don't get you don't tire out and your rhythm doesn't go out of Another round of FP. Out of you want me to put DW through that line again? Yeah, DW is constantly running through it. You just used a second loop. Oh, what do you what do you want me to push through it? Just the epi that you already pushed. Oh, okay, all right. I don't know if you want me to push anything else. Okay. No, nope. I already got everything I want pushed. Other than it seems to be more in depth medical stuff than medical. So our fire meds get really fucking in depth, dude. They 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 Keep do it in depth as well though. That's any, why this comes from meds, fire department. If the rhythm changes, say something, please. Uh, yeah, they're looking for Bailey. That? that scares me. Yeah, I can watch the uh, live pack. Cool, thank you. I'm gonna go ahead and put shock pads on him now in case it does change. We can just immediately shock before it goes back down. Okay. Yep. But again, guys, Harley Cavanaugh does have medical experience. Um, where that's from, you'll find out in time. You will find out in time. I'm still packing. Don't need extra hands. Um, just maintain scene security. We'll need some of that just in case. Mountain lions are people. At the moment, make sure someone's at the thirty-one. You're gonna take medical. Oh yes, Grant, go down there and get one of those tack units. Go down to the freeway to be medical. I'll be on security since I'm not really doing anything here other than that's I just pushed up. That's so. If we could have any route, Bay Canyon Road. How long would you guys say we've been doing CPR? Someone make a try. At least four plus minutes. I just want to get a time so that way when medics. I would say closer to five then to be more accurate. Yeah, there are medics. That was one of the hostages. Really interesting. Grant's running down there. I think. Oh, somebody's gone. I don't know. It might not be Grant, but somebody's going to grab him. And the sheriff's got, he's going down the new medical. Okay, perfect. Yeah. See the sheriff's old ass hobbling down there. <laughs> All right. Well, you can show one of the. Um, uh, if you join SAF, we have fire, that fire that civ, that three that LEO departments, which hospital. is sheriff, PD, and state, and then we have dispatch. Lift his legs. Do, do we have anything that we can elevate his legs on? Uh, he's on a hill. He's on a hill right now. So okay, perfect. Like, uh, Guys, our suspect is leaving a uh, two-door. Uh, Montana, today. do you want to switch? Are you getting tired? No, play with team. I'll still do it for a minute. Okay. Make sure his arms aren't hanging down. I want his arms, um, I guess, below anatomically, above vertically. I know, it's been a while since I've had a long stream. It's just because in fire department, in a lot of times well, things just stop going to his heart. happening in the second hour, but here, Sheriff is, you know, LEO gets, continues to get calls usually, oh, nice. so yeah, see, that's probably why. Plus this call is just really big fucking call. I came on a really good day for my first day, I think. It's just a lot of things happening. Hopefully they'll get some TXA or something to stop this bleeding better. <laughs> I'm gonna go help them grab equipment if they need help. Yep. Yeah, I think I'm doing. I I do think I'm doing what, relatively well. I'm not over. I'm not overstepping boundaries. I'm trying to really avoid that, but I'm trying to keep to her personality, which again, she's a pretty confident yeah. and. Uh, she's very confident, uh, a very serious character, so she's not gonna, not gonna realistically, she wouldn't I I believe um, be shock, afraid to uh, potentially break the boundary no to CPR be able to do a job right as well. Six minutes now. We have a BVM established. Uh, I do want cookies, Josh Baker, please. Um, ringer solution pushed in left arm. Can be pulled to four, DW zero, zero, medline one. in a right arm. I've already got. I've already got. Been pushed yeah. so far. Uh, where the mace is solid. Okay. I've got to change my medical gloves. I've got I've got a thing for that too. Everybody on airway medicine. Yes. Okay. Cool. 
Kavanaugh down there. She's uh, handling DVM. Copy. Okay. Let's start getting units over that way, please. Yeah, she can just stay on area. CPR until she gets tired, then we can switch out with her. Yeah. We got the life pack already hooked up to her, so y'all don't need to do that. Um, okay, if you just want to... What did you push again? You run that by me? Ringer solution on the left on arm, and then we got on the right arm a line of DW, and we pushed 0 0.2 FE through it. Come on, I'll switch okay, cool. with me. Okay. You count? Three, She's in the two, DW as a med line. One. One. You want PD second on for this, or going back to Metro? Okay. Young, come on. All right, let's go ahead. I'm going to run an IO in both arms, both shoulders. I like the switching thing. I feel like people right, need yeah, to do this more when they're in the IVs, the IO, great. or you can push your own. I don't care. Pumpkin chip cookies. Yeah, I'll, Bro, I'll that sounds amazing. What are you talking okay. about? That sounds freaking amazing. Someone will be entering the dirt cruise from 13, though. 102 to 201. I got further information. One ready. So, uh, you know, I joined the fire department, I end up doing, or I joined the LEO department, I end up doing firefighter stuff. This is great. And handgun <laughs> in that location, as well as a crap ton of bullets. Unknown if there is going to be any explosives, unknown oh, if there's going to uh, be any blue. gas. Chocolate chip cookies, bro, jail, I'm so hungry right now. You make me really hungry now, Cop Rock. You want air med over here? Yeah. Yeah, they, they're gonna need air med. Seven, mics, no. seven? Okay. Yeah. Are you guys willing to put her down on the dirt, or do we need to block off that highway? Because I don't know how much units we got here to do that. Actually, uh, if I look at it right now, right where that bearcat and my stage. Yeah, we'll just do dirt. It's relatively flat. So. Yeah, okay. That's so they the have plenty of flat land there. I don't want to review anybody else on here to. If they're still on scene, over losing here my ride along. I didn't really lose. I guess I did lose my supervisor. Uh, who's here not doing something right now? Yeah, Valentino. <laughs> Yeah, Valentino I was with, and then harder. like an hour and 20 yeah. minutes in, this started, and we've just been on it for the last over hour now. It's crazy. I'm out of my soda, so I guess I'm gonna be a healthy person and drink water. Alright, blood's consuming a clot, so we're starting to lose blood. I'm not even supposed to have this vest on. Valentino no. just said it's fine you enough because we're in a rush. Said? Yep. Point um, two. The vest that I should have on is probably the one that Montana has, so I'll have to get that number from her. I've not double checked his rhythm in a minute. Last time I looked, it was still ace of We are at the at thirty fifty seven, yeah, but we're action. just a little bit north oh, of. Uh, I am doing all right. The North Freeway and up a very on long a stream today. Hill. Near the railroad tracks. Here, I got you. Hold on. They're gonna get air med down. It looks like so. Still no rhythm. That he's not really pulling him out of a systole. CPR has been going on for about seven minutes plus now. Yeah, four. All right, we do have air med routing, um, so we will just continue till they get here. All right. Yeah. Um. He was in. I. He looked like he was starting to get hypovolemic hemorrhagic shock. Like I said, that's why I pushed the ringers. Oh man, I'm um, so glad they the detail they put in pack med is amazing. We obviously already have his feet elevated, his arms elevated. I don't carry blood, do you? No, they don't, unfortunately. Oh, a bitch. I okay. feel like well, Air Med would carry blood. I'm not permitted to push it. Um, I'd make a recommendation for TXA, though, if you guys feel like that's necessary. Get pale. Um, I don't really know what else we can do here. If the ringer's going, that should help promote the blood making. Yeah, I was gonna but say airmen should have blood. I don't know that shocked. as a character type. I'm not gonna. To I'm not gonna suggest well, that. Too much but... of anything. Yep, I'm gonna run again. Uh, another eye over here, and I'll put the T X. Okay. Okay, there's my first John. There you go, Dutchman. That should help him just not lose as much blood. Yeah. Just continue to just let him know. Right, he's using body heat as well. His skin's getting kind of cold, and it's also pale. TXA right there. Yeah, that's going to be part of the shock to have. We can't really cover him. First, yeah, there, there you go. We can cover his lower body, leave that leg I think open. I we have another one your bed. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Hope I hear Ahmed. 
Oh, there they are. Okay, I got airmed overhead if y'all can replace flares. Yep, he's going to do it right now. Yep, there's your yawns. Let me know if you get a shockable over there, and whoever's on CPR, let me know when you need to switch out. How's our I'll airway need, looking? I'll need, like to I'll need to swap out in about 30 seconds here. We could Copy. probably have Montana and Kavanaugh. You guys switch again. You guys are doing okay. good. Yeah, if y'all wouldn't mind. Are you ready to switch now, uh, Montana? Yeah. Uh, rhythm still ace. All right, on three, two, Copy. one, switch. Oops, I don't want to step on him. You guys need... Maybe. All right, there's our um, med right there. I mean, we're running a bunch. We got two IOs, two IVs. <laughs> Um, yeah, I think we got three. I think we got yeah, three. We got oh shit, this Garland. We yeah, we, our IVs. We've been pushing all our IVs. We have administered three of Epi, I believe. Fuck. I just okay. pushed some TX. And the yawnings begin. We got pale, cold, blood loss, and negative. He's yeah, the there's your three. Right there's your three. It right, starts. Let's pick him up, get him moved over to the medic so we can get him air, uh, air lifted out of here. Copy. We already it's got a backboard. The yeah, there's yeah, a backboard for... right here. Um, I'll just... I'm gonna slide around you. Whoever's on airway, I'm gonna get the C collar on him, and then we'll roll towards the LEO on that side. I'm gonna do a back sweep, and then the we'll domino get effect. Back. Yeah, it is Capallo. Uh, Montana hold CPR for a second so we can get her get him yep. moved. Okay, we have the backboard right here. Yep. Okay, who is at the head right now? Uh, I I am myself, Helen Montana, Helen. or not Montana. Okay. What am I saying, Kevin? All right. Whenever you are ready, um, we are gonna roll towards the LEO on his left side. Okay. Okay. All right, reach over and pull him. So that way we roll him this way. You ready? Yep. Okay, at the head, you can count. Hey, just a heads up for you guys. Keep your head low. It's going to be a hot load. We're going to load and go. Hill and Brand, go on. Mm -hmm. Hill and Brand, you count. Yep. Yeah. One, two, three. Okay. Stop go. CPR for a second, Montana, so we can do this. There you go. Just going to do a back sweep right here. We'll continue the BBM here. Okay, you can. We'll roll him back. We'll probably be going off shift after this, guys, because it has been almost three fucking hours. It's just crazy. I I think this is a great first okay. stream for right. as a deputy. To I'm excited to see what more. Yeah, I'm I excited to see what through, else we're gonna be back. doing. All right, Montana, you're gonna do CPR as we walk, so just do the best you can. Kevin, I'll same thing with you. The BBM. Kalen Brand, you want to call lift? Yep. Whenever you're ready. On three. One, two, three. Oh. Yep. Remember, when we go. get up to the helicopter, keep head down. Copy. All right, let's go. There we go. This is nice. Does he have a medic with him in airmen? Uh, they could do, but they should be back in head. Copy. Load and go. We're just going to get him in there. I wonder if anybody else is gonna. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, Montana, everybody. Yeah. Okay. I love how they followed suit. Right, yeah. Run back up, let the medic do the job. Yep. And then, yo, yep, back up. Oh, I love how people followed suit with that. Like, good. Good fucking work, guys. What an exciting first day. Watch the beautiful bird lift up and disappear into the blue. <laughs> Alright. We, we still got our goggles on. Oh my goodness! Thank y'all. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Good work, everybody. Pretty good. <laughs> Very good work. Thank you, the deputies that were switching off CPR for like forty thousand years. I appreciate. Yeah. It. Yeah. Kevin, on work. Very help. good job. I am in the Bearcat. Might be. All right. Um, I'll ride back in the Bearcat with you, Kevin. All you can help <laughs> as well. Garland, what's the look? All right. Are we rolling back to the staging. You guys are going to roll back to station until further notice. Okay. Cool. I guess we get it right in the. Kevin, in do you even have your car anymore? Still here? I'm gonna grab the bags off the hill. I'll come back over here. Montana? This is a bear cat. Yeah. What was that? I'm sorry. Do you have your car or? We could go in the bear cat, bro. I've never been in the bear cat, man. All right, great. I'm breaking off. All right, thank you. <laughs> What's going oh, on? Do we have tow for this like, guy? There's like no radio traffic. Um, yeah, it's kind of scary. Brand, do you have a vehicle here? He I do. It's right here. Right. Someone county tow that. I was gonna. I was gonna. Okay, you know what? You drive. Fine. Yep. I don't want to drive. Oh no, mine's right down there. Let me drive a boat. Thank you though. I'm county towing this. Actually, you yeah, you do. It. You search yeah, it. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. 
update for an update 3057 here, Mitch. Just listen off the station. Oh, good guy. Over to. Oh, what? Oh, I want to ride on the back like that. Oh, That looks so neat. What an exciting first aid. Closing. Yeah. Gray, what the fuck are you doing? Hey, what on. is he doing? Oh. <laughs> okay, I think I'm good now. You know what? I'm just gonna take the bag off. Oh, this is great. That was a little bit of a low thing right there. I didn't expect it to be that low. I think your back door might be open. Yeah, that's all right. We usually keep them open. They got a okay. little thing back there that keeps it open. Okay. It's usually for shorter rides, oh. but it'll be all right. The shit. Cavanaugh, yeah. for the first day, what are you, what are you thinking? We are closing. Uh, well, I definitely didn't expect what uh, had happened today, but... Yeah, neither did I. Well, it's definitely an interesting learning experience. I was able to see how you guys move around a situation like this in terms of perimeter as well as outside, uh, you know, protection. Yeah, sorry for all that confusion. My goggles were terribly fogged the entire time, and I don't know if you noticed, but it's really hard to run a part of a scene when I can't <laughs> even see who's standing right. around me. <laughs> right. Um, I found, at least for me, I don't know if it might work for you, but I uh, kind of extended uh, my uh, vision all the way up to help out, and it actually did help. Really? Mm -hmm. I tried to, like, leave and, well, like, I tried to walk away a bit, come back, no, I didn't fix it, so I was just kind of... It's all good. We got it figured out. <laughs> Bit of a confusion towards the end, but mm -hmm. hey, I think so we you caught what? everyone. Oh my god, man. That, that guy running towards the road, dude, he got lucky he got tased when he did, because if he would have ran in probably another two seconds, I was going to just, I was going to take yeah. him. I wasn't going to give him the chance. Nope, oh, because what was he going to do? He's going to go to the road, probably shoot someone else and steal a car. I think this is a great yeah. fucking stream, happen. dude. A great first stream. Yeah. I did not expect a big scene like this happening. Takes over a hospital, that's my question. Like, why? Crazy people. Why the hell would you do that? Was there a reasoning why they went in there? Oh, I don't know why they went in there, but but even just the thought... Pro like, what about my car? I don't have my car with is, me. Don't worry over about it. Hospital. There's nothing but sick people and doctors. Everyone in there is and medicine. A lot exactly. of expensive medicine. Well, uh, that's the thing is they went after vulnerable people. It's just, it's fucked up. Very fucked up. I agree. They got, they got what they deserve, whether that be even in a cop car and a... Purse. I don't fucking care. They got what they deserve. Anyways, I think that uh, I think that the locker room is calling. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah. Don't blame me. If uh, if you wanted to stay tonight, I could find you another FTO. No, 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 no. Two twenty-seven. I think I'm very tired right now. I feel that. On the way here, if you can check in with him. It's nice to be able to use some of my medic experience, though. Yep. Are there any final words you want to say to me, or am I just gonna go off to uh, here and? Well, I, I mean, yeah, I want to say very. I mean, Lieutenant... for a hectic patrolling it was, it did pretty damn good. Um, we didn't really do much before, but I mean, you didn't get in any trouble while you were out on the ground, pretty much alone. So, I'm, uh, I'm proud of that. Uh, you asked some really good questions, so keep that up as well. Of course, um, and five. pleasure to meet you, Lieutenant Gray, as well. Hopefully we'll yep. uh, have some time to get to know each other. Yep, good to meet you, Kavanaugh. Bruce, you guys can call me yeah. Harley if that's... I don't know if you call people by their last names or not, but you can call me yeah, Harley yeah, as well, fine. whichever right. is best. Alright. Anywho, I'm gonna get some Myself sleep, just good god. Locker rooms yep. in the back, I assume? Yeah, yeah do, back here. Do the double doors right. to the right. If you'd like, Pleasure. you can get changed Pleasure. in the bathroom. Uh, I think I will. Pleasure riding with yeah. you, uh, Lieutenant Valentino. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. All right. Finish that door right there. <laughs> Three, eight, one. I'm gonna go ahead and relieve all you guys from this call. Let you do the investigation. This is fucking amazing. All right. Um, let me see who we're gonna be rating today, guys. We are gonna end it here today. I think this is a great fucking ending. Um, let me go ahead and go ten. What's your twenty? I want to. I'm gonna be coming over. I don't know if I'm supposed to call up. Two twenty one. Show me ten seven ten forty two. I think that's how I call it. They didn't actually go over how I clock in, clock out. So I'm just gonna assume it's the. 
same thing here, but let me just add in a few last comments, guys. I will say today was fucking amazing. That was a great scene as well. Like, seeing it from this perspective, that's crazy. I was actually happy to be able to sit in the back and just observe everything. I missed a duck. Why didn't I get a duck? I didn't get the notification. Holy shit. I'm so... Yeah. I'm so sorry. You know what? I'll give you a duck. I'll give you a duck. Hold on. Where's my notification thing? I gotta give you that duck. Yeah, I think I, my, I accidentally uh, clicked mute streak things in instead of skip. Charger. So I'm gonna just grab up my my. Um. So I'll uh, give you your. I'll top. give you your little oh, uh, good duck. No, you're good. Just why are you at my station, man? Um. Where's my duck? I'll do. I'll do this uh -huh. one. Thank you. <laughs> there you go. Thank you, Carpark, for the five thousand bits. <laughs> Once again, thank you very much for supporting me today. I this is Rock, a test amazing. Bit I'm gonna go ahead and leave the, to the back Not here. Mm -hmm, sure. Oh, excuse me. You're good. Pleasure meeting you. Uh, what what is your rank? I'm sorry, Montana. Deputy two. Deputy. Should I just call you Deputy Montana then? Yeah, that's fine. All right. Pleasure meeting you and working alongside you today. Nice. Have a good day. Uh, we're gonna. Did you or? Oh hi, Jimmy. No, you didn't hit me. Oh, excuse us. All right, we're gonna just leave, Logan. so we're not. We're gonna actually take a smoke. One thing, really quickly before we leave, Harley does smoke. I finally have a character that smokes. So we'll go over here, go away from the building, have a smoke, and some final comments. Um, but thank you again for everybody who supported me today. Hopefully, you guys do enjoy this character. I have a lot of backstory for her, and honestly, I can't wait to see what comes out of learning about Leo does for me as a player, but also what it does for this character. Um, yes, I have a Civ set up for her off-duty, but right now, I think she's just gonna take a fucking smoke, because that was a fucking stressful-ass scene, even though I didn't have to do much. Um, but yeah, um, thank you for not judging me today. Obviously, we didn't get to do much. This Today was just shadowing. I think the next time we're on, we will be actively doing traffic stops at the very least. And we'll see how things Dang go. Valentino, so you did fucking amazing. I'm so glad you gave me that, like, internal RP and bonding between Valentino and Harley Kavanaugh. That was fucking sick. Like, that's what I want in RP, and I, I hope I, I hope you enjoyed it as well, honestly. Smoking is bad for you, but this is Harley's character. She is a smoker, so is her husband. Just, she, she just smokes. That's just how it is. Um, this is a character being brought in from... Red M, so I'm keeping to a lot of her things. Um, so yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the character again. You'll see her more often. Uh, you'll learn more about her backstory as we go. You guys need to pay attention to everything she says, guys. She is an information gatherer. She has a past. You'll have to find out about it. But thank you for stopping by, guys. We are going to go ahead and raid Max Magus. Um, so go say hi to him. He's a great streamer and he's really fun to hang out with uh, i'll see you guys on tuesday i don't know if i'm gonna do fire or leo uh i might also add in an extra streaming day as well for the sake of doing another leo thing i have no clue we shall see but you guys have a good weekend and uh